Hey girls, hey everybody. Hi, hi. Happy Friday, everyone. Thank you guys so, so, so much for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope you're all having a lovely Friday. How's everybody? Ooh, 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 that's a lot of fries. Thank you guys so, so much for all the French fries in the chat. You know how much I love them. Hi, 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 hi. <laughs> hi, everyone. How's everybody doing? Are you guys good? Did you guys have a good Friday? Woo! It's over. It's Friday. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. The paper clips in the chat. DG, oh, my God. The paper clips in the chat. We're 10 seconds in and you're trying to take me out. Oh, my God. That is too funny. <laughs> Hi guys, how is everybody? I hope you guys had a great Friday. It's the end of the week. Oh, oh it was a hell of a week. Um, I hope you guys are all good. Oh my God, there's more <laughs> paper clips in the chat. The paper clips are gonna take me out. Y'all, we are gathered here on this Friday for a very special edition of The Girl Gang. Um, I'm sure most most of you, everybody, everybody's heard by now. If you're putting paper clips in the chat, y'all know. There was some wildness, let's call it, in the middle of the night, okay? <laughs> it was wild. It was long. It was a lot. We're going to get into it. We're going to go through it together. Um, I want to say it's not edited down, the version we're going to watch, but it's sped up, and I've just taken massive pieces out. So, um, the, what do we have here? We have about two hours and 40 minutes total. Okay. We can skip ahead. I, listen, listen, I'm going to be, I'm going to be straight with you guys. Okay. She was on all night. As y'all know, uh, I had a full day today. As y'all know, I, I am home a little early though. So it was good. I didn't have the time to clip this thing down. Okay. Just massive sections out. We, we have a lot to get to today. Oh, um, would that be Nerdwool? Nerdwool, thank you so, so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for being here, boo. Guys, uh, oh, Shannon. Hey, Shannon. Thanks so much for being here. Guys, it was so much last night. Uh, there, was, there was so much said. There was a lot going on. It's a lot. It's a lot. You, you guys know. Everybody's been talking about it all day. Whew. Yeah. It was a lot. It was a lot. There's a lot. There's a lot to talk about today. Oh, Seattle Sapphires. Oh, sorry. No, uh, Dreaming Fool 2. Thank you so much for Super Chat, girl. I really appreciate it. Thank you for being here, boo. Um. Oh, my God. Stabby clips. Stabby clips. <laughs> yeah, I just took pieces. I stabbed pieces right out of there. <laughs> oh, my God. Seattle Sapphire's Low Carb World. Thank you so much for the Super Chat. I really appreciate it, girl. Um, okay. <laughs> Guys, she gets into a lot, a lot of the Dom stuff. This is this is a lot, okay? I feel like before we even start today, there should be a bit of a warning. I know I don't really normally go with, like, trigger warnings and stuff, but I think it's only fair considering how much is discussed in this stream, y'all. If, if, if you're triggered in any way, if you are having already a bad day for whatever, whatever, just, just step away today. You know, this will be up on the channel. You can always watch it later. Don't ruin your Friday for Chantal. I feel like it's only fair. This video is a lot. Okay. Sarah Allen. Thank you so much for the super sticker girl. I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, like I said, I, I, we don't usually do things like that on this channel, but, but I think, I think the video we're going to watch, you know, we don't usually watch videos like this either on this channel. So fair warning. Okay. Put it that way. Fair warning. And, uh, no problem. Y'all step away. Like the, no hard feelings. Okay. At all, at all. Um, Sarah Kalnash. Thank you so much for the super chat, girl. I really appreciate it. Okay. Now guys, this is a long one. Even clip down, it's a long one. So we're going to just get into it. I'm going to try to keep the pausing to a minimum. I know I always say that, but then I can't help myself. And then, there's a lot to say tonight, okay? Or from this video from tonight. Anyway, if you know, you know. If you don't know, you're about to find out, okay? She's She talks about a lot, a lot. A lot of the things that I was being called a liar about, 
are suddenly being admitted to tonight. So, you know, I'm going to have opinions. <laughs> I feel constipated. Volpe, no, I'm not okay. I'm not okay. I'm not okay. That feels good to say. Actually, yes, I'm all right. I'm all right now. I know it doesn't look it. The Charlotte sometimes, hi. The shadow, yeah. Admitting is the first step. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god why do i look like a freaking oh, i don't even know what this collar is so i love the collar on this shirt the collar is everything i don't really like this thing well it's not bad actually i got this dress from amazon hi messy jesse so i just um After she passed, she just never saw her in her watch. Sammy T, thank you so much for the super chat. Do you, Cosmic Carrie? Miss Frizzle. <laughs> the Magic School Bus. She has like really big, I wish I had her hair. And she always talked like this. I'm wearing polka dot. You are? Oh, the drama I just went through. And you all don't know anything about it. <laughs> I can't tell you either. But just know that. It is concluded and I feel victorious. That's all I can say. <sighs> SJL, thank you so much for the super chat. Okay, so we're starting here. We're starting with uh, clearly wrecked Chantal, right? She is in a state. She's in a state and we're just starting the video. She's pissed off. And high as a kite. That is quite the combo. Um, that has been, historically, where she opens her mouth. So it's like you knew it was going to be a good one before she even started blabbing just the state she's in. Sandy Shores, thank you so much for the super sticker, boo. Yeah, I feel like I'm going to an interview somewhere like downtown Toronto like or at a bank. Would you like to invest in our mutual funds? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just going to point out from the start so everybody notices there is an extreme amount of jaw shifting in this video. It's a lot. A lot. Mental confusion. Yeah, that's exactly what it is, Charlotte. Mental confusion. Thank you, Missy Jesse. I so want to go to Toronto. I think we're going to move there. You remind me of my bestie. Every time she's involved with a man, her brain turns to mashed potatoes. Kels. <laughs> hi, Quinnisher. Bad seed. Oh, hi, bad seed. Welcome to very important visas. Ready, set, bees. <laughs> I think bad seed. Hmm. I don't want to call you a hater. Huge ass. It is real. If it really is concluded, Grand will be proud. Um, oh, yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, guys, listen, listen. Her volume is all the way up. Is my volume like too loud? I can turn me down and then y'all can turn everything up on your computer or phone or whatever. Would that, would that be better? Let me turn me down. Hold on. Because this, this is as loud as Chantal gets. Okay, I'm quieter now. That might help. Is this better? Is this like, <laughs> okay, okay, we'll try like this. Let me know. Is that a stroke? Oh yeah, no, I have to see my doctor. I'm going to call First thing tomorrow when I get up, I wish like I had like a, somebody to remind me of these things. Somebody message me tomorrow. Joe, why don't you watch me anymore? You always remind me of things. Those eye glares tell all. What? 
Um, Liliana, or Liliana, yeah, it's more of like just suddenly done. Like, like I'm just suddenly done. Like I've just had, I just realized like my extra anxiety and everything, my mood changes when I go to be with him and not in a good way. You know, where he's starting to be like, why are you so bitchy? And it's like, I think I'm having like some kind of like um, reaction I don't even control like when I'm around. And then tonight, like it was just like, hi. Why are you so itchy? I don't know. I'm having some reaction. I can't control. Just like the was the allergies. Now the scratching at her face and stuff constantly is going to be some reaction I can't control. Okay, sure, girl. We buy that one too. Mm. Hard spun candy. Thank you so much for the super chat. Jess, what kind of very important piece are you trying to set piece? Um, just so many like lies tonight. Like I just feel like. Anyways, I don't want to really talk about it. Um, let's just say that. Uh, yeah, Jillian. You know what? I don't want to sound cocky. That's the thing. But no, I'm just, uh, I don't want to. <clears throat> Lavender Sage, take care of yourself. Thank you. Please let this be true and you will now focus on beating the live streams. Oh, thank you guys. You guys really, really, really didn't like him, huh? <laughs> no, I just like. <laughs> yeah, what a surprise. The supporters would hate a Koki who's taking advantage of you. Shocker. Come on, man. I just want to say, I don't want to scare you guys, but I need your help that if I know that you guys know my address, you don't have to send, don't, don't, please don't call the cops or anything, please. Let's just bees. But if I ever say, I want to give a sign, if I ever give a sign, that please, please, please call. Okay. Is that like, is that without be scaring you? No, I just mean like, uh, I'm sorry, Mia. See, I don't want to like be dark. John Baxter, PSA, micro dose is one question. Okay, John, so it's 0.1 for micro dose. Okay, no, that's good to know. I'm going to talk to my doctor about it though. Okay, uh, safe word. What should it be though? Because I don't want to accidentally say it one day. That's the problem. Has to be something we will not accidentally do because calling authorities when they're not needed is very serious. All right. Please understand that. Holy moly. Okay. Dreaming Fool 2. Thank you so much for the super chat. Y'all turn mine down more, please. Okay. I'm going to turn mine down more. Hang on. Um, so for real. Oh, it turned me back up. Interesting. It turned me back up again. Why? Stop. Stop. You stay. Okay. Why would she have a safe word with her chat? Okay. Can we just talk about this for a minute? Y'all. She asks her, her chat to come up with a safe word with her. Hmm? When she knows damn right that Koki watches her streams. Is, is it just that she's so dumb that she didn't think of that in the moment? Or was this manipulative? I can't tell, but it's a little sus. Hmm, what do you guys think? That was, that was wow, wow to me. Ms. Raven Nevermore, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Yeah, I'm, I'm curious what you guys got from that because that was very, very weird. Very weird to me. Manipulation, manipulation sus. Hella manipulative. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I, I, sometimes, you know, I wonder, am I the only one who feels like this? Right. So I like to throw that out there, but that's weird. Weird. I don't know if you're that scared. Wouldn't you be thinking a little more? So if you were thinking a little more, wouldn't you be thinking that Koki would be watching your streams? That's just where my mind went. Oh, yeah, I agree, Shannon. She really is. I have a bad feeling you're right. <laughs> please, please respect this. 
I'll do anything, just respect that. What is what should the sign be? Yes, see, doctor, please. Okay. You're right. Should I just yell call the call? Okay. Let's just no, but I just need if I'm ever maybe, you know, faith strong. What could it be important bees? Randy said bees. Yeah, okay. All right. Let's just uh let's just yeah, let's talk, change the subject. Oh for bacon. Oh yeah, I have bacon in the fridge. Now that I've terrified you all with needing a safe word with the chat, just in case someone shows up here. Yeah, no, let's change the subject and let's just make some bacon. Let's eat all the pork. Lavender sage paper clips. Yes. Should that be the word? Because I don't use paper clips very often. Yeah, Liliana, no, I don't, I don't want to worry you guys. I really don't want to worry you guys. She doesn't have to pretend to be halal anymore. <laughs> okay, paper clips. So if I ever yell paper clips, you know why. Or if I just, I don't know. You, you know what I mean? I like paper clips. <laughs> why am I laughing? Because I, you know what I said in my last stream, very high on. Paper clips. <laughs> I need to get paper clips from the store. Get mace. Yeah, does anyone else think, or is this just me, my opinion, that she's a little too like excited? This is like, ooh, this is fun for her on a certain level. I don't know. She's got that smirk on and paper clips, paper clips. This is this, I don't know, she doesn't look too terrified to me. pizzas like I have a sword I'm not afraid of anybody I'm just saying if ever I don't think anyone would do anything but you never know it's just good to have that you never know this is the one time where if you know where I live might be a good thing right <laughs> anyway yell it three times lavender sage paper clips paper clips like oh, like beetle shoes okay I'll say it three times paper clips paper clips yeah. Okay. So if I need to, yes. But no, I didn't mean don't. I just said it like just to practice, but don't do it. <laughs> so yeah, no, that's not sus at all. I'll just yell paper clips three times. Paper clips, paper clips, paper. No, yeah, that that's normal. No one would ever suspect something's going on. Nobody's threatening me. I'm just saying just, I don't know. I have like a precaution, you know? So anyways. He has a sword, yeah. Pete has swords. I don't know how to use one. What's a sword if you can't use it? I would I wouldn't never stab somebody with a sword. Never in my life, even in self-defense. I would be one of those victims dead on the street. But you you know what? You never know how you would react in a situation, you know? But anyway. This is insane, isn't it? Oh no. I kind of just left him in the street. Like in a shady part of town. Because I think he's lying to me. And I can't drive now. I, you know. <clears throat> he was supposed to get a ride to my house. Jess, welcome to Very Important Beezers. Ready, set, peace. He was going to, he said that his friend was going to drive him to my house. He said, you go back to your place. And, okay, yes, I lied to you. I am. I did lie to you. He was going to come here. We decided after that I was going to go there. And then I think he heard me say on the live stream that I don't want him here because it's like our safe space. So maybe he like, I don't know. Like, I don't know. Like he watches my streams. So he called me right after I ended the stream. And he said, I said, I'm coming. He said, no, I want to go to your house. Like I'm sick of being at my place. I should have said no. 
and the whole way driving there, I'm like, I'm so like, my mood was starting to change as I was driving there. My mood was starting to change. Even he was like, why are you so bitchy? I just felt like he was lying to me about something earlier. Um, so uh, I'm really sorry I lied to you guys, guys about that. Something so stupid and small, I guess. But I was going to go to his place. Um, so I guess I didn't really, did I even lie about that? No. So for the for like the first time ever this summer, you get an apology out of her with one breath and then, but wait, did I really apologize for that? Or do I, did I really even lie about that? So the one thing she apologized for, she like taking it back. Nice, nice. Okay, so then what happened was I went to pick him up and the cat hair really bugs him, he knows. So I picked him up and I was sober. So Same. I'll play the story, let me finish it quickly. Pick him up, driving back. And he said, well, why don't you drop me, drop me off at my friend's it's on the way to your house, which is not, it sort of is, but not really. So and uh, he's like, you can clean the cat hair until, you know, and then my friend will drop me off back at your house. So that's what I heard. That's, you know, because now he's changing it and saying that's not what he said. He misunderstood it. Sandy S. Welcome to very important business. Where he said, peace. And actually, if we're telling you this, I don't, I'm not supposed to talk about it. So, but anyway, okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> I'm not supposed to talk about it, first of all. Second of all, okay. So, Koki's supposed to come over. Koki makes an excuse for him to be dropped off at a friend's house because now she's a taxi service apparently come get me at my place drop me off at my friend's house and tell her to go home and clean the cat hair <laughs> and then he'll get a lift to her house yeah right okay now She's going to go on to say that she had doubts about him being able to get to her house. It's like, I knew this was going to happen. But she went home and got high. Now, if you knew this was going to happen and this was going to be a problem, why did you take a handful of mushrooms, ma'am? Maybe, if it's possible, you could have stayed sober for a couple hours, cleaned the fucking cat hair, and then gone and picked up Koki. Problem never existed. You know, No, no. No, but Chantal, already doubting that Koki would get the lift to her house, just got fucked up. Well played. Oi. Uh, Coronado uh, A, thank you so much for the super sticker. Hi, Monica. Thank you. Hi, Sandy. So, you wanted me to clean the cat here. So, then, so that, that pissed me off too. So I'm already like, let's adding a layer. This is why I want to know why I'm done. This is why this is like adding to the annoying. Like, you know how I am? And I'm in like a fragile state of mind already. Like with everything that's going on, like, and just everything like grief and just being fucking bitchy. And, and so <laughs> I'm sober. So <clears throat> I'm like, is it great? Isn't it hilarious that she calls herself sober? Ma'am, you're not sober. You're just not doing one of the substances that you've been doing all summer. Jeez. Mandy, thank you so much for the super chat. Being like that because I'm being crabby. I'm like, okay, well, where's your friend live? You know, like, oh, my God, when I'm bitchy. So, so I wanted to say I don't feel like cleaning, you know, but I did text him that after. So anyway, I dropped him at his friends. Um, I caught him in a lie, too, because he's like, this is my friend from a long time. When he, Every time I come to, anyway, I'll tell you that after. I'm getting sidetracked. So, what happened was, thank you, Sandy. Um, so I come home, take mushrooms, take edibles, because he's supposed to get a ride here. So I go live. So I'm like, do I have time for a quick live? Because I'm addicted to live streaming. So that's when I do my live stream. And uh, yes, yes, honey, whatever. Hangs up. Then he's like, I'm outside. So I go all the way down. That's when I ended my thing. I open the door, nothing. I hear my phone ringing. I run up all the stairs. He, he videos me and I knew in the background he's not outside of my fucking complex because he's in some kind of like, he's in like, guys, yes, compared to some countries, Canada, like the bad areas here are so glorious, but no, this was, I could see it was like a bad area and I'm just like, poor shaming. Uh -huh. I, and I knew, I knew, I knew this would happen on the way home when I dropped him and said, he's not going to have a ride. Imagine that would happen. 
it did. So that, I'm just over it. So <laughs> he called, he's like, oh, I misunderstood, baby. So I'm like, uh-huh. I'm like, okay, I'm coming. I hang up the phone, we text. I'm like, I had edibles. I had mushrooms waiting for you. I can't drive. I'm like, get your friend to go bring you back then. See you later, Ella fucking Gator. You think I'm stupid? Monica, Grams might be giving you some messages from the other. Uh, yeah, girl, he does. You've been stupid all summer. Why the fuck would things change overnight? Uh, <laughs> come on. He's literally done whatever he wants, gotten away with whatever, said whatever, not even bothered saying, gives explanations, gives no explanations. You take it. Why the fuck would that just change suddenly? Please. Shrimpgate, thank you so much for the super chat. Other side, my love, try to try to help you. Monica, don't make me cry. Thank you, Monica, so much, so much, so much. I don't know drag you somewhere with his friends, but you never need to put yourself in a situation. <laughs> He's gonna be so mad. What I'm talking about. That's why I'm like, if ever. So that's why I left him in the street. That's why I'm a little scared because I left him in the street. <laughs> well, he doesn't. He doesn't have my address, but like, he's been here. Uh, no, Queenish. No, girlfriend. <laughs> Not this time. You guys, I can't. Like. Ah, the perfect for moment for the first poll. I'm going to drop that. I want everyone's opinion. Oh, yeah. I know, like, you think he's ugly or whatever, but he's really, really good in bed. So that's what kept me, like, you know, like, freaking teaser. <laughs> and. Anyway, and just like the typical, like, he's textbook in a lot of ways. And this, the unfortunate part is that he doesn't realize he is. Oh, no, I don't want to piss him off. Or, anyways, what do you want to talk about? Oh, my God. Oh, this is, I'm just laughing because I can't believe my situation. This is nervous laughter. UV Rays, thank you for the super chat. <clears throat> Sex or your safety. No, Volpe, I mean, I thought I loved him like really bad, I did, but I don't know. I'm acting cocky right now, but I'll probably miss him, sadly. No, really, I don't, like the amount of stress I get is just not worth it. We're just not compatible, it's just not worth the stress. And I think I just still harbor a lot of resentment from our fight. Like I have a lot of resentment and I can't get over it. And I told him that and I poured my heart out about it. He said nothing. Like, so are you coming over? Like, what about what I just said? But I will admit that he does have a right to be mad. Like, I really feel bad that I like dog cut these dogs and everything. And <clears throat> no, I do. Because it's because of me and I just feel responsible. Like I have to make up for that. I'm like I should like give him money or something for ruining his life. TM, please. Uh, pause right there. And I think everybody knows what's coming. Ma'am, what do you mean you got to give him money for doing it? You've been giving him money since the end of April. I'd say you're even and then some, okay? Leave it alone. Jesus, give him money. Please be careful in these streets. What? What do you mean? Should I be worried about something, TM? <laughs> careful, Nightly, thank you so much for the super sticker, boo. Yeah. Stressful, like so stressful. That's what that's what I'm like, that's what I keep telling people. I'm like, I'm treating him. Like a normal boyfriend, like uh, I have to keep saying, like, think of all these red flags and all these bad things, and you know. So what are we eating, Julia? Wait, so did you buy earlier about the memory loss while you were driving? No. So what happened with that was when I dropped him off, I dropped him off, and then. I had to put my GPS on to get, like, I didn't know where his friend lived. Like, I didn't know that area. So 
I used my GPS to go back home. But then like when I got to a familiar area, I turned my GPS off. Um, and then what happened was, <laughs> and then what happened was, I don't know how, but be, the next time I took notice was like, I noticed I was like back in towards where he, he, he lived, not towards my house. And I'm like, wait, did I, I did that automatically because I know the route, but I'm just like, what? This is scary. Like I need to be at home. I don't need to be driving right now. No, like that's scary to end up somewhere. You don't know how you got there. I agree. That is really scary. And we all know she's been driving under the influence of whatever for months now. That's terrifying. You, you, you didn't get to the destination you intended to go and you don't even know how you got to where you are. Ma'am, stop driving. You're a menace to society. Karen Raposo, thank you so much for Super Chat. That's, and, and to be sober, like, you know, Joanne for ruining it. Oh my God, thank you. Screen joy flags big time. Yeah. Do you, Chantal? Can someone tell me? Um, I can't really talk about all that right now. Alicia Sud. Hi, welcome to Very Important Pieces. Ready, set, peace. I really like this dress, guys. It makes me feel. Does it remind you of like Susie Shear <laughs> or Reitman's? I think I'm still too fat for Reitman's. I feel fat shamed by Reitman's. Do you guys? Liliana. Tacky, tacky. Thank you for the super chat. I can't afford it in my life. <laughs> I can't in any sense of the way. So, mm. should have been so much. Yeah. No, I can't talk. Thanks, your warning. I honestly like beating with you guys. <laughs> it makes me want to cry. I really do like beating with you guys. No, I don't feel like talking about I don't think that's a good idea. Yeah. Lori Cobb, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Go, buddy. To say one thing and say it with conviction, just like you are now. You know, the average subscribers for three to zero wants to get sober. Yes, I, I know what you mean. <clears throat> Alicia. Thank you, Alicia. Thank you for the sticker. It's so cute. It was 100% cooked, Hugh Jazz. <laughs> Oh my God, how do I check that queenish? I don't want my, I don't want it back. The lipstick is a mixture of lipsticks. I don't want my phone back, Mia. I'm okay. I know, Misha. So that's what happened with the memory loss thing. So that did happen. That freaked me out. And then earlier today, I FaceTimed him. And I just felt like he was the, he was like acting weird. And then like I was talking to him on like FaceTime and then all of a sudden I saw a shadow behind him too. And then he cut off quickly. He's like, I'll call you back. But I didn't want to tell you that story because it's the shadow might have been somebody in his case in his room oh my god where's case Where i was gonna say that's that's some kind of weird drug paranoia ma'am that he, there was someone in the bedroom what the fuck that he was trying to have is is this for real is she really trying to pretend like we don't know or is she does she really believe is she gonna play some kind of psychosis to pretend like koki didn't have another woman at the trap last night <laughs> that is just ridiculous. Worst case, TM doesn't have a key. No, no. You guys, I would never do that. I want to, I would never put them in harm's way. I would friggin' take millions of bullets from my cats and repeats, but no, I want, I don't know. The homeless is here, girl. Oh my God, Marissa, I don't want, left him in the street. 
Yeah, my guts just tell. My, I get in a, a literally get in a bad mood, and my cats, BBJ, <laughs> BBJ literally loves everybody. Like you see how loving she is. She she's afraid of him. She hates him. She runs and hides the whole time. I'm like, dude, my cats don't like you, and that like made him really mad when I said that. Like okay, pet people, pet people. I'm a pet person. Y'all know your animals tell you right. For, like, like what she just said, BBJ loves everybody, hates Koki's guts. That is a huge red flag. Holy shit. That people, you know, you know, and I know red flag. Mm. Mm -hmm. Emma V, thank you so much for the super sticker girl. Lavender Sage, welcome to very important music. Ready to say peace. I love Marissa. Anyways, why am I doing this right now? I'm going to get my mouth is going to get me into a lot of trouble. It is. I can just feel it. It always does. So I'm just going to shut it. Right? Physical reactions, Jess. Yeah, I've never had that. He even recognized it. He said, you're having your stress because of me. I'm like, no. Yeah, it is. Should I put the phone down? Well, yeah, I'm gonna have to. Um, welcome, yeah. Welcome to Very Important Resource. Sandra, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. <laughs> we treat you better. I, I, like, it's comforting to come and be with you guys, yeah. I feel like I'm surrounded by a thousand people right now of safety, and in reality, I'm by myself right now. That's not fair. I don't think that's fair anyway. Maybe it's my own shit coming through because I've kind of been in a situation like that. But I don't think it's fair to put your safety and stuff onto your audience like that. I really don't. I'm not just nitpicking. And that, ooh, that makes me feel like skeevy. I didn't like that. He said something. He said one time, like, He said something really scary one time. He said, call the cops. Cause I like threatened the cops before. He's like, call the cops. I have time to kill you before they get here. And he's right. He's right about that. What the fuck? <laughs> Antoinette M, thank you so much for the super chat rule. Y'all, so they fight so bad that she has to threaten to call the cops on him. And he says, I could kill you before they get here. How would you ever see that person again? That would be the last time I ever saw that person. Are you fucking kidding me? Ma'am, that person just threatened to kill you. Okay. You could have called the cops right there and pressed charges. That alone, he didn't have to touch you. Just what came out of his mouth right there, uttering death threats. That's a fucking charge, ma'am. What are you playing at? Pathetic. Mind blowing. Not just pathetic. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. The abuse only happened once, guys. Which kind of abuse? <laughs> you know what I mean? And no. Wow. That's really oof, 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 oof. Big, big oof. Big red flag. I don't know. How do you ever, ever, once you hear that out of somebody's mouth, and this, keep in mind, this is someone she doesn't even fucking know. She has known this person for four months, okay? How do you ever close your eyes to go to sleep next to them? I would never, I, I wouldn't even want to like blink too long around them after that. That's terrifying. <laughs> I know you guys are freaking out. Yeah, that's not normal. Um. Ronnie Arrington, welcome to very important. Be serious. Ready, set, peace. 
Oh, you said there's a bunch of the people back. I can't stick around. <clears throat> Seattle Sapphires, low crab world. Thank you so much for the super chat. Excuse myself. Excuse myself. Okay. Super spray. I don't know, Queenish. I don't know why. It's just never enough, you know. But now, yeah. Um, thank you, Ronnie. I mean, like, I actually physically just can't, like, be around him without feeling anxiety, and that's not normal. Um, so I think maybe there is some kind of, like, just reaction to things that have happened in the past, because um, Luvia. Hi, Luvia. Yeah, yeah, sure. If a guy beats you, I'd say there'd be fucking anxiety around him. You'd be afraid when you're going to catch the next one. Makes sense to me. I don't know. I don't know what the mystery is there. Um, yeah, Era, I'm sorry if I butchered that girl. Wind song, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Uh, all kinds of very important bees are ready to bees. Hello, Leah. Yeah, it's not worth the aggravation. It's stress even for good sex, yeah. I don't want to watch you on an episode of Dateline. I know. Sarah, welcome to Very Important Beasters. Ready, set, peace. I feel like, oh my God. I feel like people are like, yep, yeah, you're doing the right thing. We're going to resubscribe. <laughs> that's what it feels like. But that's not, um, I feel like BBJ senses that he's just naturally like a violent person. And do you know what I mean? It is morbid. I feel weird talking about it so publicly. You know what I mean? Like, I feel bad. Like, am I allowed to? <laughs> Lucky Lola, look at a very important piece first. Ready, you said, peace. <laughs> I mean, like, I don't, you know what I mean? Like, if there's another person involved, I have to be really careful what I say, right? Or. I need to get out of there. I can't drive. I don't even want to drive now when I'm sober until I see my doctor. I'm like, honestly, like, or maybe it was just because of being around him was stressing me out. <clears throat> no, ma'am. I mean, yes, ma'am. I'm sure being with him does stress you out, but it's the drugs. You're starting to fucking lose it, man. Y you took off driving somewhere and ended up in another place. You th that is the drugs. No. Early. He actually blames me for like when he's mean to me. <sighs> Thank you, Liliana. <clears throat> Anyways, speak your truth. Messy Jesse. No, Jesse. Stacy DVD. Welcome to very important meeting. Ready to peace. <laughs> Yay. I love seeing all you guys coming back. Lisa, thank you so much for the super sacred goal. I don't think this is really good. What is it? I don't know. You can tell your side of things without dragging other people. Your experience in your life. I know, but like it involves. He is safer if you don't speak up. I'm 100% free. No, I, I don't mean it that way. Oh my God. I didn't mean to say that. <laughs> you guys, I'm sorry. I don't feel edibles, but I feel something from the the chocolate, the psilocybin, the mushroom chocolate. It's like weird. Yeah, I don't believe that she only had that mushroom chocolate. I think she took a handful of mushrooms. She's way too high to have micro dosed or eaten the micro dosing chocolate bar. Unless she ate like a few of those chocolate bars. If not, she just did like last time mushrooms. Um, Tiana Vobora, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Daria, six out above you. Generally, think everyone you know personally and the 3,000 people in your live streams are wrong about him. You guys don't even know like a fraction of it either. <laughs> Michelle Baron Smith, your relationships don't start like this. <laughs> what the fuck?
stuff. Sorry, guys. I pretty flasher. Look at her for reasons. Are these hippies? I'm allowed to flash. Angel, look at her for reasons. No, what do you mean, spill what? So we can hold you accountable. Guys, this is really serious stuff. Like, I can't really just, like, yeah, it's such serious stuff that you can't stop laughing. Such serious stuff. Oh my god, guys, guys, such serious stuff. Ready, set, be. Would really, probably, really, really, really trigger him, like, really bad. Please don't die. The net needs more flashes. Are you gonna join my OnlyFans then? So, foodie flasher. Don't spill anything, don't poke the bear. Exactly. I don't think now's the time. Yeah. Dreaming full too. Thank you again for the super chat, girl. I've just I've heard him say really scary things that are just very like dark. And I'm just like, so now I'm a little like, like for, you know, I just I don't know. I don't want to talk. I just don't want to talk. I look right now. Hi, Vegas doll. Yeah. Should I take the stream down? Bella Lucio, thank you so much for the super chat. And I told you guys when I was in my room eating spaghetti meatballs for four days straight. About after the thing happened. Oh no. It's not normal or comical to be threatened to be killed by your significant other. No, of course not. Yeah, it is very serious, actually. <laughs> and at the time, I was just like, Whoa, is that like the threat? <laughs> but you just whenever just brush it off as, well, I know they have an anger problem, so how do you brush that off? Ma'am, he has an anger problem, so so what? He's been beating the shit out of you for four months. Take it like abusing you in so many ways. Oh my god, I wish I had brought this little paper. Anyway, I'll get something after. But <laughs> Almost every type of abuse that can exist in a couple existed in this couple. What do you mean trying to excuse it? It's not one thing you try to excuse and, oh, well, besides that one flaw, he's such a great guy. He's an all around user and piece of shit. What do you, what do you fucking make excuses for him for? Um, uh, Marissa Solis, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. I, I don't understand. Like I get making excuses for the abuser. Been there, been there for a long time, but you know, <laughs> I keep saying it, but yeah, it was after years, after fucking years, you do, it's it's a different attachment. It's totally different. And with a guy that had a lot of fucking qualities and an anger issue, not a, a, a loser, a welfare recipient, uh, sorry, not to shit on that, but like he's able-bodied. He's just a lazy addict. You know what I mean? I'm sorry. I have no respect for that. Get off your ass, go get yourself clean and go get a fucking job. To sit at home taking advantage of a woman like that? Ugh, 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 and act like a macho man. Where's the macho man? Where's your balls to get up and go get a fucking job? That's not a man. Sorry. Um, Tiano Vobora, thank you so again for the super chat, girl. <clears throat> no. You got swept out. It's like threatening Chantel. It will affect your emotions for the rest of your life. Really? It will impact my emotions for the rest of my life? So, is it such a thing that things affect you physically you don't even realize? That, do you know what I mean? Oh, I'm hungry. Cinematic Jewels, thank you so much for the Super Chat Girl.
Michelle, just look at the difference between him and BB. It doesn't even compare. <laughs> Michelle's very smart. Yeah. I feel safe with BB. But I'm not like in love with BB. But uh, I do love BB. <clears throat> That's a lie. Come on. CL Sapphire's low carb world. Thank you again for the super chat, girl. Uh, maybe this is just my opinion, but I think she's still very much in love with BB. Uh, thinks about the one who got away, BB, all the time and knows damn right that she'll probably never get a guy as good as BB, as good to her as BB. That's just my opinion. Um, Tiano Vobora, thank you again for the super chat, girl. I really appreciate that. I do love him. He's a set amazing person. I always love him. When I told him my grandma Pat, he called me like right away. Right away. Thank you, Kim and Terry. You need to feel safe with the person you're with. No ifs, ands, or buts. Yeah. BBJ knows BBJ. Go back to BB, please. <laughs> you can't see it. Just go back. It doesn't work that way. BB's a gentleman. He's good friend. Yeah, she wishes it was that simple, right? Oh my that. god. <laughs> CC, thank you so much for the super chat. Oh, fuck. Oh, I dressed like Miss fucking Frizzle for nothing. I'm not even getting any dick. Do I say that out loud? Priorities. <laughs> oh my god, what the hell? I'm sorry. That was an inappropriate joke, actually. My, I'm not like, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to microdose anymore. Macrodose or microdose? Which one is it? You will find someone better. It just takes time. Yeah, magic's cool, but I think. <laughs> Dust off that Tinder. <laughs> Sorry, I guess. Monica B, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Congratulations. That is such fantastic news. Yay! <laughs> no, seriously, though, congratulations. That is fan fucking tastic Ooh, let the good feels happen all weekend girl enjoy it thanks so much for being here i guess laughing is the way i cope with stuff even if it's at inappropriate times which it always is oh my god it always is tinder this is the 20th it's over straight and done um down yeah panella Oh, I see that now. Yeah. Actually, FFG was still wrong. <laughs> Actually. <laughs> about a lot of the stuff. But I didn't want to talk about her. Wrong about what? Literally. Talk about double down at the wrong moment and looking stupider than you have yet. Wrong about what, ma'am? Literally, what 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 was I wrong about? Okay. What you've said so far in this stream, what you're going to go on to admit to in this screen stream. Literally, where's the lies? Where's the things I wasn't right about? Pathetic. Pathetic. At the same time as you're gonna admit to all of this. You got balls to say something stupid like that, ma'am. So she's still over time. Came over. Did she move? VIB? No, she wasn't right. Right about what? Oh, you mean about um Oh, sorry. Oh my god, I'm confusing everything right now. This is weird. Um Oh, that's cute. That's cute. So what, the confusion was what, a preemptive strike? So now she doesn't, it's not that she was wrong. 
accusing me of lying about things that I hadn't lied and been wrong about things that I'm certainly not wrong about. Now, oh my God, I'm confusing things. Oh no. <laughs> Oops. Oops, go fuck yourself. How about that? You're a fucking liar. And this little cover doesn't work either, ma'am. Eat the crow, okay? I was right about everything I said. I didn't lie about a fucking thing, as you're going to go on to confirm to us. Just shut your face. This is the moment where you, you, you humble down a little bit and you shut the fuck up. What did she say anyways? I don't even know everything she said. What do you mean she's right about like him being abusive? We can't talk about stuff. Let's just change the subject. <clears throat> so I've been talking to you about him for 20 minutes and about abuse and about all kinds of crap. But no, no, no. Because now we're going to prove that French Fry Girl was right. We're, we're going to change the subject. But I want to talk about that. And I don't know what she was saying. So I'm asking you, what was she saying? But let's not even talk about that because I'm about to eat shit for being so fucking wrong. So let's change the subject. I don't think so. I want to harp on this fucking subject, girl. Wrong. I told you so. Right. Shannon, also right. Okay. You owe Shannon a big fucking apology. Forget about me. I'm not your friend of 23 years. Do I feel like you owe me an apology? Yes. Do I, would I hold my breath waiting for one for you? No way, asshole. I know you. But your friend Shannon, and I don't mean online for pity and ass pats, deserves a private apology. Whether she wants to accept it or not, that's on her. But you owe her a big one, man. Mandy, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it, girl. <laughs> no, no, and no, 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 no. BBJ. <laughs> BBJ. <laughs> Shells, I found the love of my life on Tinder, but I waited eight. Oh, no. And as usual, when cornered and doesn't know what to say, we need a little cat deflection. Oh, PPJ! PPJ! No, ma'am. No, ma'am. There's no deflection. And we're not leaving this subject just because you want to leave this subject. I'm going to harp on this for a long ass time. You were wrong. I was right. You're an ass. I was right. Okay? We're going to keep coming back to that because I love it. I never thought... Honestly, it, like it became your word against mine. And I never thought you would confirm it so fucking spectacularly for me. Like the idiot that you are. Thanks, dumbass. Waited for 18 years. Be patient. You're so genuinely gorgeous. I love, I love watching every day. Thank you, shows. He just messaged me, said, thanks, babe. I love you too. <laughs> for leaving him in the street. Yeah, well. My cats don't like you. Thank you so much, by the way, for the super chat. <clears throat> you will manipulate. I don't care. No, no, no. Yeah. <laughs> he will manipulate back to you. Yeah. Michelle. I don't have to be aware. Dandy, would you ever go on a date with the owner of the Kiwi Farm Stretch Me? Also, prayers and good energy to you for the loss of your friend. Thank you so much, Dandy. And um, I don't think so. <laughs> you should delete the stream before he can watch it. No. I don't want to get off. <laughs> Baby girl. She's smart. Yeah, listen, listen. <laughs> I've noticed that me and Shannon have a lot of going. Some of the thinking is very much the same. And uh, as the words came out of my mouth that she owes Shannon an apology, in my own head, I went and she could fuck right off with that fucking apology if I was Shannon. And look, Shannon's is the same thing. Same, same. But that's not the point. Shannon, Shannon, you don't have to accept it. But let her give it to you. <laughs> you, you deserve it, you know? Come on. You're wiping your old age. It's the ball spots. And you smell. Yes. But you still love me. 
oh my god i can't handle the loss of another elderly person in my life bbj she's 19 and i know she's on borrowed time that's old for a cat please don't ever leave me wander all around i met my partner on tinder then she asked me to marry her two months later i said sure Oh, that's cool. Oh, like, hey, listen, oh. listen, listen. I'm a jerk and I love to be right. So, of course, this is like, yes, you know? Oh, it feels fantastic. It feels fantastic. Not going to lie. <clears throat> Josh Moon? No, but he will, like, not stab, but I mean, what about, what is sexy about uh, making fun of me? Oh, wait, 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 wait. So now we're going back to he's making fun of me. What happened? I thought he was making you comfortable with your body by poking at your fat and calling it boobs. Now he's making fun of me. It's amazing how she flips on that when she needs it to be something, eh? Amazing and noted. Lisa, thank you so much for the super sticker, girl. <laughs> My dog is looking old. I think about it every day. Why haven't I blocked you? E. It's such a bad feeling about you tonight. Thanks, SG. Actually, Lucifer, you will be back live tomorrow, trying your hardest to convince everyone. What a great Karen guy, Dolly. Roll eyes. <laughs> Well, I hope not. No, I won't be. No, I'm not going to say, oh, I hope not. No, I'm not going to be. No, I've seriously had enough of this. I've just like, Liliana, what did you say? I like how you put it. Um, You're just done. I'm just done. I'm done. you like, you know, I'm done. That's, I'm done it is very heavy. You don't need to say anything else. Uh, yeah, except that we've heard you say that countless times all summer. So I don't buy that one for a second. Openly avoidant. Thank you so much for the super chat. I'm done. I've been through some shit. A lot of shit. And it's why, you know, so. Thank you, Liliana. I really hope so. The chapter has changed. We're all ready for it. I do still have a thing against bed sheets, yeah. And they're going to stay here. I'll just drop them off and run on live stream. Locked on. That's my phone number, though. <laughs> How does that work? <laughs> okay, I know the number by heart. <clears throat> uh, I know. I shouldn't be dealing with it. I shouldn't. I did this to myself. More bruises on her arm that looked like fingerprints. Yikes. Oh, I need a massage. You can count on anyone but yourself, Chantel, as always. I'm just kidding. That's not true. Healy Road. He makes fun of your body. No, 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 Chantel. I think in like, well, like a joking manner, you know, like. No. Disengage. Um, Oceana Song, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Really appreciate it. And agreed. <laughs> like legal, just the, well, natural stuff, cannabis. Not as much. Oh, no, Sandra, yes. Because of the, I got to find out what's going on. Actually, my doctor might tell me to. Oh, you're, uh, no, serious? You know what? You know what I just realized? I'm an asshole. Because there's not enough information out there. Technically, it's not. Like, there's no legal clause saying how many hours you should wait before ingesting a certain amount of edibles before driving or whatever. But, like, with what happened tonight, I don't know if it was just stress or being distressed because I was 100% sober. So maybe it just there's, like, long-term psychological effects of ingesting, like, large, large quantities of the edibles or something. You know what I mean? Yes, ma'am. 
and it's not the edibles and we all know it's not the edibles you have overkilled everything all summer you haven't been taking your medications you have uncontrolled diabetes this is a cocktail of problems okay you shouldn't be driving and it's not just the drugs So that means that means I'll have to talk to my doctor then. Cause maybe they can like give a proper dose. Ow. What is this? Two hours after consuming. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I don't, I don't talk too much. Lisa, thank you so much for the super sticker girl. Who? Oh yeah, exactly. You know, if you come on here, you talk about somebody, blah, blah, blah. They can like sue you. Please don't end up in a mental institution. <laughs> I don't want to, guy. Julia Rufford, why do you drop such serious bombs like this all over your audience and then giggle while they worry about you? It's so messed up. Also, FFG was right. I don't even know what this whole thing with FFG, like, I don't know what you're saying. Like, are you condoning how she, the nasty shit she says? Like, our, I mean, I don't understand. Actually, I don't watch her, so I don't know what all everything she said. Like, I don't know what is Kiwi Farms and what is her, but a lot of the case, or the, the details surrounding, like, the case he was involved in and everything told you he was dangerous. Well, okay, pause right here. Um, Amber Ray Richardson, thank you so much for the super sticker, girl. What details did I ever give on this YouTube channel about the case that he was involved in? Ever. A fucking word. Ever, ever, ever. Until she mentioned the stabbing first. Because I know it's zero. I never mentioned it, and it was very purposely done. So I'm not actually waiting for the answer. The answer is zero. I never fucking mentioned that. Because that was Koki's private life. And for months, over and over, I repeated that Koki's fucking private life wasn't my business until you talk about it on your YouTube channel. You're the public figure, ma'am. You brought that shit up? Fair game after that. And you damn right I mentioned it a couple of times. Until you did, not a fucking word was ever said on this channel. So cut the shit that, oh, I don't know what was her and I don't know what was Kiwi Farms. As if you don't watch every fucking word that comes out of my mouth and read every goddamn page on Kiwi Farms. Ma'am, get the fuck over yourself. We know you. We have known you for years. Cut the shit, this fucking game playing manipulation bullshit to cover for the fact that you're so fucking wrong and I'm so fucking right. It's certainly not going to work on me. It might work for you stupid brain dead VI Beezers, but there's no VI Beezers here. This is girl gang, okay? We know how to think. It's a little different. You're going to have to try a little fucking harder than that girl. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Marissa. Like, yeah, I was trying to drive. I got kind of like, I couldn't recognize where I was for a while. And then like, like before I knew it, I was like, wait, I'm driving all the way back to his house. I was supposed to go back to my house. It was a weird, it was weird. I don't know. Anyway. It's not defamation of character. It's not? Yeah. Why is it? It doesn't matter what FFG said at this point. Exactly. This is not her, like, this is not her story. You know, this is my story. Why is she even in this? <laughs> okay, so now that she can't say I'm a liar anymore, which is what she's been spewing out of her stupid fucking mouth for three weeks, now it doesn't even matter what French fry girl was saying. Now it doesn't even matter. You know why it doesn't matter, right? Because I was right. She was so fucking wrong and I was so fucking right. So now it, it doesn't matter. This is my story, not her story. This is my story. Me, 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 me. Stop talking about her in my chat. I want all the attention. This is my chat. I peeped that girl. I think you're stupid. And I think that is like so fucking childish and dumb, but you do you, girl. Those are your VI visas. Take all the attention you need, and we know you need a lot. Me, 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 I, I, I. Fool. 
Like, why is she inserting her fucking self into my life? That's my problem with her. Perfect pause. Who do you smell? Do you smell something? Because I smell something. And he stinks to high hell. And his name is The Gaining Ground. And eggs. That is the exact words that those two fucking idiots use. Who do you think, like I've been saying, is always, yak, 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 right in her fucking ear? Who's inserting herself, you dumbass? I privately and discreetly contacted you and gave you all the information, and then some, that you were about to spew on this fucking live stream on your channel and confirm everything I said. I never said a word about your coked out loser ass boyfriend besides what you put on your channel. Never spoke about his life. Um... Who's inserting? After we spoke, I walked the fuck away. I didn't say anything about the phone call until you started doing it. And I certainly didn't keep talking about anyone or even Koki until you came on a live stream, coked out of your minds, and had your loser boyfriend threaten me after doxing my phone number. Do you remember that? Because I remember that. And I'm certainly not going to remember that. So, again, tell me how I inserted myself, you dumbass. And she's doing it so like, you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Maybe if she was nicer about it, maybe if she was like, hey, I'm only doing this because I'm your sister. Sure, you say that. And then you freaking like drag me for filth. How am I supposed to? And then like. Okay. She wants to keep going back to that sentence because she doesn't understand because she's an idiot why I said that in the messages with Koki. Why did I say not to her? that I'm her sister. I said it to Koki and I'm about to be really fucking real with you guys. And we're going to take the kitty gloves off. Okay. Because I skimmed right over. Why did I say that? And yes, I was playing into Koki and playing into the culture. Do you know why I got so terrified when he started messaging me that depending on what I answered back, he was going to turn around and beat the shit out of her. So as angry as I was that she had given my phone number to her coked out loser abusive boyfriend, I was still trying to keep him calm to protect her in those fucking messages. No, you stupid bitch. I don't want to be your sister. I would never say I was your sister. And you know what? I feel pretty fucking bad for your sister. If you want to know. Like there's like lies inserted in truths and like, I just, I don't want to listen to this. I don't want to associate with somebody like her. Like I don't, I don't, I don't get good vibes. I don't get good energy from her. I don't think she's an honest person. I don't think she's a good person. Sorry, I'm pausing a lot, but I am heated. Okay. I'm going to say that I'm extremely glad that you don't get good vibes from me, that you don't like me, that you don't mesh with me, whatever, because you are possibly the absolute worst judge of character that I have ever seen in my life. Let's just take three. Okay. A list of the three people that she thinks are good people. We got Koki, we got Negs, and we got the gaining ground. So yeah, girl, if you think I'm a dishonest person, a liar, an asshole, a whatever the fuck, I'm pretty goddamn happy about that. And if you think that of me, fine. You don't have to follow me. You can unsubscribe, you can do whatever you want. Just talking to her for like an hour and 20 minutes, um, on the phone, just listening to her, just, that's just the vibe I get from her. And yes, I get really bad vibes from him too. And that's why. See you later. Really? It's funny because while we were on the phone, you were so fucking terrified about the shit that I was telling you. You didn't seem to have bad vibes. You seem to have a shaky fucking voice because you had a hard time swallowing everything you were hearing. But it's funny how you forgot that, right? Although you're about to spew everything I told you on that fucking call. Everything that scared you so bad that night that you could barely speak and you were crying on your fucking end. Shut. You are the most insincere, ungrateful piece of shit that I have ever seen in my life. Tracy M, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. I really appreciate it. And y'all, I'm just remembering because this was a big day. Her grandmother passed away two fucking days ago. Have we heard a word about grandma? We are 43 minutes into this stream. I haven't heard jack shit, but I've heard a lot of pissing and moaning about French fried girl. So again, we see where your priorities lie. Ugh, disgusting as usual. No surprise though. We know you. Seattle Sapphire's low carb world. Thank you again for the super chat, girl. 
I can't ignore it anymore. You know, um, a lot of it was, I felt guilty. Like I feel, and even now I feel guilty leaving him in the street. Like I'm like, Pete's like, should I call him a taxi? <laughs> like send him in a taxi home. It's going to be like 60 bucks, you know? Fucking doormat, <laughs> Christ. Anyway. Why pizza in the fridge? Because you care so much, yeah. Do I feel safe? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, you should never have to uh, falter on answering the question of, do you feel safe in your own fucking home? <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> Pathetic. I have no more sympathy for this bullshit. You put yourself in this position. You kept yourself in the position. And now you're going to act all fucking terrified with, do I feel safe at home and give me a fucking safe word? Shut the fuck up. Me, Marie Fupa ain't free. Thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Homeless balloon, yeah. Anyway. I can mail paper clips three times if I need help. He's a fucking baby man. Yeah. Oh, sorry, Purple Mermaid, what? He's not coming out. Yeah. What did orange chicken say? Yeah, my doors are locked. Michelle, don't feel guilty. The big boy, he's not your problem. <laughs> yeah, I said, well, I took edibles and I'm not going to drive now. <laughs> like, <clears throat> sorry. Oceana Song, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Listen, listen, don't get me wrong. This actually feels good, okay? <laughs> I'm getting shit out that I've had to bite my tongue on for months now, okay? I think when the gloves come off, the gloves come right the fuck off. I don't care anymore. I honestly don't. I have been super diplomatic and sitting on the fence and being so fucking nice for what? Not anymore. No, no, no. After having psychosis, I took edibles. And mushrooms. Is that concerning? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. No. I'm sorry, I feel like an ass. I, took, I think I took too many mushrooms. <laughs> no, no, for real, I think I did. Arms up, Chantel, show them. <laughs> Why? That's your life, but are you truly happy? Um... With what? Like what specifically? Like, no, there's things I need to change in my life to be happier for sure. To just, oh yeah, no, I need to make changes in my life. Thank you, Dina. I appreciate that. Y'all, I was so goddamn diplomatic. And I, listen, I'm Greek. You see how heated I get real quick, okay? Maybe I shouldn't blame. I'm sure not all the Greek people are like me, but I am my father's daughter. Let's put it that way, okay? I get heated. I go zero to 100 real fucking quick. I was live streaming. I don't know if you, any of you guys were here. Y'all will remember. I was live the night that she doxed my fucking phone number. Do you guys remember that? And I saw it in the chat and my phone started buzzing. People were calling me inside. and I calmly and diplomatically sat here like an asshole and bit my tongue. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> Everything's fine. Yo, 
No, if I could go back to that fucking day, that fucking moment. That was my bad, my bad, okay? I was too fucking nice. And maybe that's why it's all boiling over so hardcore today. I've been pissed off, to, so fucking pissed off since that day, okay? This is the truth coming out now. Ooh, ooh. It's been extremely hard to stay diplomatic about her because my opinions have shifted. I can't help it. The last Nashville chicken. Thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Sorry, uh, Passion Tim. Just uh, I left on in the street and uh, <laughs> I don't know what to say. I can't say an FFG, but how is someone supposed to tell you that you're severely sick? I mean, without coddling you, tell us how and like us. Um, I don't know. Do you think making fun of, I don't know, like, isn't she like a big asshole? Like makes fun of me all the time, makes fun of my looks, just like fat shames. Here we go again with the bullshit that she has been spewing about me for a month. I never made fun of your looks. I never fat shamed you ever on this channel. And I'm sick to fuck. Like I have fucking had it of hearing that bullshit because it is her go-to excuse. She is used to her entire life, everyone hating her because she's fat. In her mind, that's been what she excuses it away for. Ma'am, it's your shitty fucking attitude that people have hated your whole life. Being fat has always been secondary in your case, okay? Don't get it fucking twisted. And you're not going to play that shit on me. I'm a new reaction channel, ma'am. I only started reacting to you when Koki came into the picture. You can go back. Every video I've ever made about you is still up. Find me where I fat shamed or insulted your looks. You've insulted mine a shit ton of times, though, if we really want to go there. I just don't harp on that shit because I don't give a fuck. I don't need to find excuses and yeah buts. That's your move, not mine. I have better arguments. That's for the week. You can keep it. I've seen some pretty nasty shit she said about other people, like really vile stuff. So... Uh... All right, I'm also fed the fuck up of hearing that. So you know what? We're going we're going all in today. We're we're talking about it all, okay? That that bullshit cuz again, that's gaining ground in her fucking ear, okay? I've seen some really vile things that she said to people. No, no. I made one nasty tweet to the gaining ground at the end of 2020, possibly the beginning of 2021, okay? One tweet that oh, they choose to harp on and get all fucking like panties in a twist about okay they neglect they neglect uh, to explain that the day that i made that fucking tweet to that stupid ass the gaining ground was the day that he had been threatening my friend and her daughter and accusing her of being an abusive mother and accusing her of locking her kid in a fucking closet all day long all day long that doesn't matter the tweet that he got from me, they've been harping on this shit for like a fucking year now. And I'm fed up of it. That's your big fucking argument, you dumb bitch that wasn't even directed at you. It had nothing to do with you. So get that shit out of your mouth and keep it for Gigi. He can keep that, 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 that over there yapping his fucking gums about it. I don't give a fuck. The irrelevant can fucking stay irrelevant. Don't give a shit. But I'm sick of hearing it from you. Um, You guys are like excusing everything else just because she was trying to be she's she's making you think she's being self-righteous in her being a fucking douchebag like she's being righteous about it um just because you hate dom so much you're willing to forgive everything anything anybody says you know what forgive what honest to god honest question here guys i'm being real and i want the real truth okay if i've been an asshole let me know because i'm sick of hearing it and it's starting like the gaslighting is starting to fucking get to me what have i said that's so fucking assholeish and people need to to look past about her honest to god i've said nothing but the truth nothing but the fucking truth and everything i told her on the phone was also the truth but it's pathetic You know what I mean? Um, so. Well, I don't know. Lay down in comfy clothes and enjoy your trip. I don't want to be alone right now, Florida. I want to like, I want to. <laughs> 
thank you so much for the Zoom and chat. Openly avoided. <laughs> That's funny. When I get pissed, I get quick. Fuck these guys. She's a hater, full stop. Yeah, no, I just get bad vibes. Doesn't mean I like her, but she doesn't make fun of your life. Okay. Lori Kahup, thank you. Oh, thank you again for the super sticker, girl. I really appreciate it. Hold on right there. Wait. So after calling me a liar for the past three months, now that she spilled everything in this fucking stream, right? She can't call me a liar anymore. So now she just gets bad vibes. She gets bad vibes from me. But you know where she had good vibes, right? Hitting that mattress on the floor with the fucking addict. That was good vibes. That was cool. Negs, that fucking panel. Sitting there like an idiot, like a fucking joke with Negs and Gigi. Mocking the domestic abuse that I went through with the fucking hammer thing. Laughing your high ass off there. That's good judge of character. That's a good vibe. You got good vibes going on there doing that. I give you a bad vibe because now you can't call me a liar anymore. Go fuck yourself. Emma V, thank you so much for the super sticker. Okay, well, I'm good. <clears throat> kind of thing does not shame you for you. <clears throat> and beyond her ponytail, I don't do that either. Like Shannon is the one who said she looked like potato head or whatever. I, I think that's low. I don't make fun of people's. And I don't like when people make disgusting like jokes about like, she said people were making fun of her eye. Like, and that's like, that's from fucking trauma. Yeah. Shut up. Keep my fucking trauma out your mouth. How about that? You can just keep talking about your own fucking trauma. You don't have to talk about my eye. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. The other side uses the fact that I have a wonky eye because I was attacked with a hammer in a domestic violence assault as a thing to harp on. Oh, look at her fucked up eye. I told her the story of the, of the eye, but man, that's neither here nor there. And throwing that in there just to throw it in to, to what say something that I told you on that phone call. I peeped that well played. Um, you ma'am have made fun of my looks way more times than I've made fun of yours. And bringing up that, no, no, it was Shannon that called her Mrs. Potato Head. Ma'am, Shannon wasn't a public figure. Shannon wasn't on YouTube. Shannon was kikiing with her friend, making fun of somebody who's talking, in her mind, talking shit because she was listening to you. That makes sense to me. You're coming on your public platform, making fun of me for months now, and then trying to act like you're the attack victim. Oh, she makes fun of my logs. No, ma'am, that's you. That's all you, not me. Uh, I don't give a shit. <laughs> if, if Shannon called me Mrs. Potato, I don't give a shit. Shannon isn't a creator on this platform. That's you again dragging in Shannon's things. Shannon's a private per uh, person who gives a crap what she says. Honestly, it doesn't affect my life, you know? The last, um, the last Nashville chicken. Thank you again for the super chat. <laughs> yeah, she has called me Mrs. Potato Head a bunch of times. Made fun of my teeth. Made fun of my hair. Made fun of my five head. Made fun of my skin. Made fun of my body. Made fun of my life. Made fun everything, everything. But yeah, no, I don't know what French fried girl said about me, but she she body shames me. Oh my god, it's Queenie. Thank you so much for the super sticker girl. Asshole. Like, you don't make fun of somebody for that, you know? No, I don't like people hurting each other. Like, I just don't like that, you know? Stay on as long as you need. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Take away your security, like, go on. Yeah. She was babbling bully. Well, if you want to say that she was right about him in a lot of ways, yes, she was. Oh, wait, 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 what? Oh, ma'am, we're not just glazing over that one. Hang on. So the woman who called me a liar for the past months, if you want to say that she was right about him in a lot of ways, she was. Well, that's just you saying that I was right. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'll take it. Not today. Thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Oh, how long are you going to keep talking about the fucking phone call? You inserted. Your, oh, here we go. Inserted yourself. Anybody who wants to come in here with their inserted yourself bullshit, uh, spewing what they hear on other pathetic. Let's not go there. Hearing what they hear or repeating what they hear on other channels. 
Please save it for those other channels. Nobody's interested and nobody inserted themselves. Somebody made a private discreet phone call, gave somebody information, said, okay, bye. Okay, save it. In a lot of ways, yeah. Um, but things that, even if you tell me, I'm not, I mean, you know. But at the same time, I can't expect people to just be like, oh, like um, whatever information I bring on here and whatever I tell you about my life, what happens, just to be blind. Like, um, I think I saw a plain cheeseburger say once, like, you know, we can see, but we can't feel. And it's like, no, I don't want that either. Cookie Puss, I love you so much. I love you too. I love you too. Thank you, Cookie Puss. Tree Boy Ilium, cheer, cheersing my bowel to you through the screen. <laughs> Cheers, Tree Boy. For you, I guarantee if you continue to take edibles and mushrooms, I'll be. Weed Witch, I think I'm starting to think that too, though, that I think I'm going to have to like just cut it out. Cold turkey. Maybe I won't need it as much. Um, Crystal Burrell, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. <laughs> so the relationship is, I feel like the relationship I was in was um, very, very, very emotionally taxing, stressing me out, and I just can't handle it anymore. That's the gist of it. Um, I'm just finished. I'm just done. And I want pizza. I'm hungry. Yeah, I'm just slowing down on the drug right now. <laughs> on the, the weed and everything. <laughs> okay, wait, I need to pause. And this is a me pause because I'm literally sitting here getting hot. Shannon, and then I see Shannon. I'm fucking livid. And I'm like, yes, <laughs> Shannon. I can feel my heart. Like, I'm so angry. I'm sitting here so pissed off. Holy shit. She has an account there. She's hypocritical. Yeah. There's something I don't like. About yeah. I don't know. I don't trust. I don't know. Do you know what I mean? Like you, you always say trust your gut. Well, I'm trusting my gut in this case with FFG. And I just choose to not associate with persons of her nature or with herself, I should say. I don't want to sound snobby. I'm not saying I'm superior to her in any way. I'm just saying that I don't think as people we would mesh and that's it. Oh, girl. <laughs> Where do I even begin? You're damn right we wouldn't mesh. You're damn right. I'm not even going to touch that. I'm just going to say, thank God we wouldn't fucking mesh, okay? You are so fucking right that we wouldn't mesh. Holy shit. You are a woman I watch on the internet. You are no one I would ever associate with in life. Let's be fucking clear and 100% on that, okay? You're going to follow your instincts on me? Girl, girl. <laughs> considering how bang on your instincts have been for the past few months with Koki and oh, for all the years that we've known you on YouTube, it doesn't just start with Koki. You've always had fucked up instincts. Again, I feel blessed that your instincts tell you to stay the fuck away from me. But I want to make it clear because everyone with this inserting and like trying to be Chantal's friend, I don't, sorry, Shannon, no hate. Okay, I know y'all are friends. Okay, I don't, I don't mean this as a dig at all. I want nothing to do with this woman in real life. Who the fuck, honestly, would want a friend like this? <laughs> Ma'am, we've seen who you are. I'm sure most people actively avoid you in life. I know that's what I would do. You are a sh freak show that we watch online. Let's not get it twisted. Thank you very much. If you could please uh, just... Uh... Yeah, respect that. <laughs> Continue to make videos about me. I, doesn't bug me. Cookie Bliss. Seriously, though, I'm so sorry for your loss and will support you always. Thank you so much. You know what? I kind of feel like I'm so absorbed into, like, I'm so absorbed by my YouTube world. It's like my real life just feels like so different. That I can just escape into this one, you know? Oh, I've been called a liar for months. This is just my I told you so stream. <laughs> the rotisserie chicken? No. I ate some. I did buy groceries, though, to bring over. Yeah, I did. <laughs> well, 
what? Maybe. Yeah, Stacy. So. Do you want a sugar baby? I don't want to be a sugar mama, actually. Well, no, I don't. I will never stop raging. Never. <laughs> <laughs> don't tell me my business. Shit. I will. Sorry, Paul. <laughs> What's with that face? Thank you for the sticker. No. I love a beauty. Anyways, guys, he doesn't have to spend it. Yeah, Marissa, and oh my god. I don't know how many times I've like freaking talked about this. Ugh, I have ow. I have a pimple on the bald spot on the back of my head. Okay. Nice. Can we just, just can we just forget the whole summer? Honestly. Okay, what would it take? Oh hell no, we can't. Oh no, 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 no. You know what I'm gonna do, guys? Every few months, if this ends, because I don't think this is over, but when this ends, okay? Every few months, just to remind everybody of this summer, I'm going to do a refresher. I'm going to do a, let's bring it right back to the front of your mind. Let's remember what we went through all summer. She will never, never forget this one, okay? This will be around forever. I will make sure that we all remember. <laughs> you guys, honestly, can we just like, where did I leave off? Can we just resume? I swear, if you're willing to forget, I'm willing to forget, like instantly. I swear to God, I swear to God, I swear. Is it like beyond repair? Can we just forget this whole summer? For real, I'm not joking. You love head pimples? Oh, hell no! <laughs> okay. You want to see a lot? What? Oh. No, Purple Mermaid. How come I didn't see your comment, Purple Mermaid? Oh, Purple Mermaid, I'm doing a purple. I don't see a Purple Mermaid. Maybe there's a blocked word in it. Why does it always do that? Summer 2020 deleted. Daria, how much power do you think he feels knowing he can abuse it? After thousands of people speak up, you're not safe even after him. You said the next few up. Hmm? Wait, what? Oh, I see what you mean. No, I don't think so, Weed Witch. No, no. No, 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 no. I'm seriously, I have a case of the ick, as they say on Love Island. So no, I'm actually turned like if you turn me off, that's it. I'm done. I know that sounds bad. Considering how serious, like, oh my god, like Pete's is an SJW. So people I'm, I just want to write off the summer. And I swear to God, people like Pete's SJW people would have like would be horrified by my summer. But I just I can't. What does that mean? Can someone clarify? Like, I, I, I was trying to figure out what does that even mean? SJWs would be horrified by my summer. Can anyone figure that out? Am I too old? Do I not get it? What's she trying to say? I don't get it. Very confused. Um, like it, troll it. Thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for being here. Yeah, SJW. He's a SJW and somehow SJWs, yeah, social justice warrior, somehow the social justice warriors would be horrified by her summer? I don't get it. Oh, wait, wait, ooh, ooh. Mary Beth Wiley says, I think because Koki is racist, sexist, and all the other ists. Oh, that makes a lot of sense, girl. Oh, okay, okay. That makes a lot of, a lot of sense. Hmm. Kamal Seven Mile Dog, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Can't like, there's so many like atrocities in it, but I just can't. Uh, I know I have to mentally process everything, but I just don't. I don't know. Anyway, 
So I just want to go find something to eat right now, I think. No. No. Peace. I know, where's peace? Hold on a minute. Hold on. He didn't answer me. I yelled for him, but he didn't answer me, so I don't want to... I lied about what? No, I told you what really happened. Oh, hold on. I told you what happened. Oh, don't look at my carpet. Actually, Sam? Um, it's plugged into the lamp, I think. It's like a white... We don't have an Applebee's here. No, do we? No, we have Denny's. Nice. Two for 20, 20 orders. Alex, hey girl, Alex Glitter Queen. Thank you so much for the super chat. I really oh, appreciate or the super sticker girl. I really appreciate it. Uh, okay, Kels B, you're pretty good at summarizing. Should get you to write my what? No, that's not true, actually. Lusty Tire Fire. Hi, welcome to Very Important Beezers, Lusty Tire Fire. Ready, set, ease. Oh, yeah. So we have a safe word. I mean, like, if I say it three, paper clip three times, they know to call the authorities for something. You think that's wise? Probably. Probably. Yeah. So Pete thinks that the safe word is a good idea. So she's she didn't realize how stupid it was to say it on stream. And now a second person didn't realize how stupid it was to just say it on stream. This is ridiculous. The first person possibly believable. Two people? Two out of two? Ridiculous. Yeah, so I did a good thing, right? Mm -hmm. So, I won't get hate for this. I'm just kidding. Oh, God. I mean, I don't even... It's pretty bad. If I have to ask myself, question my own, like, did I do something good? Because I get, like, people hate for every single thing I do. Where's the furry intruder, Sam? I will remember this. Oh, yeah. What, what is the safe word? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Should I quit my day job? If you want to. Wait. If it's making you really miserable, find another job and then quit first. Like find another job first. Meth by 4,000, thank you so much for the super chat. And thank you so much for being here, Boo. Not really, actually. Oh, was there a joke, Lilia? <laughs> Accountable beauty, it means it's no one's business. Just because uh, we fight doesn't mean I'm gonna like do them dirty and like, you know, I was cursing my life and everything. Are you fucking kidding me? Ma'am, you have told us everything about his personal life up until now. Why the hell would you stop? And if you're really done with the guys, why the fuck would you stop now? Oh, this is ridiculous. You, <laughs> come on, little, too little and way too late, girl. Oi. Uh, Ning Ninja Penguin Pirate, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Well, I don't know. Like, I just don't want to get like that, you know? It's just, as a person, it's just, like, against what I believe in. I hate when people do that to me. I would rather be oblivious. Maybe I like songs subconsciously. I don't even know why I like them, but for because they apply to my life. <laughs> I don't know. Anyways. T. Oh my. I think like it's just like a another foolish like relationship when it's actually like, I don't know. Anyways. Let's talk about something else. Pika poop. Trailer dropped for Spider Man 2 on the PS5. Oh, that's for real. That's his mouth taken from the first magic yeah. show. Spider Man 2? Yeah, new, uh, new Spider Man game. Can we, like, is the PS5 for sale now? 
Oh my god, look at BBJ, guys. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. She looks cozy on your lap there. And you look happy to boot. Huh? I'm miserable. What? I'm miserable. You're enraged right now? Mm hmm <laughs> Looks pretty good. <laughs> You're miserable? You lie. La is too cute. I knew he liked him. They love each other. They do. She fucking loves me. I hate her. But. Play Resident Evil 7. Pete, stop ignoring us. Because they're not done. My sister's not getting married. She went to a wedding. That's what you're <laughs> The old chonker. BBJ? Uh, make him a pie and put pie in it. I'm looking to see if the PS5 is available. Um, Best Buy says maybe. No guarantee. Pete Bam says you never do anything to help yourself. If you hate your job so much, you need to find a new one. It's not that easy. <laughs> and honestly, it's not even that the job is that bad. Honestly, like the <laughs> the job I have right now is certainly the best I've ever had. I'm just afraid to skip anything forward because she she's so like sporadic with what she says, you know? Like <laughs> there it is. Everybody hates working. I mean, let's be real. Every single day I had to go to work. But you find well, no, that's not true. So Walmart definitely doesn't have uh, PS5. Between oh, the gotta love SF415. Thank you so much for the super sticker. I really I'm appreciate it. You. I'm never going to block you. <laughs> no one's mad. Even Pete's is not. Pete's can handle criticism better than me. You love your job. You like it. Because people, some people, a lot of people enjoy their job. I know. Um, Purple Mermaid? I'm ignoring her? No. Yeah, Punisher's gonna come protect her. Pete's voted for Aaron O'Toole. And conversion therapy? What? What is that? I like my job. I like my I like my job dealing with you beezers. Stacy D B D. Where did you go, Stacy? Yeah, it's looking like PS5 is probably still not really available. Uh, I gotta go pee. So it's still not available? Looks like. Mm. Noodle, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. I really appreciate it, and I completely agree. Uh, Knights of the Old Republic. Old uh, Star Wars game. Really? Yeah, that game was really good. Knights of the Old Republic. Did we watch that one? It's not a movie. No, the video game. No, we went up. No, I have not read your email yet. Oh, God. If you sent it even like five hours ago, it's probably buried. <laughs> My email is so. Uh... I always get back to you on Insta. <laughs> <laughs> ah, S Jam. Hmm. Thank you. Thank you for that. <laughs> S Jam just threw me under the bus. No, I do get back to some people on Instagram, like, but it's not just a matter of like prioritizing people. It's more of like whose message I see like up front. <laughs> I just like if when I have time, I just try to read as many and reply to as many as I can. But I do get a lot, you know. So oh, she gets so many. She's just such an online influencer she's so busy she gets so many messages and she has so much to do in a day that she can't answer them <gasps> influencer who where would, what oh my god please my chat's a mess right now it usually is playing g for now she's a busy lady you look to her <clears throat> no time for id Wifey has been outed. What do you mean? Fresh ingredients, I know. I think it's accountable beauty is fresh ingredients. <laughs> you can't tell. Pam. End of this month, right? <laughs> yes. Kills. 
Okay, guys, what do I eat? I'm hungry. I have chips. Oh my god, I have chips. Oh. Oh. I have to make sacrifices. She bought the Walmart brand of chips to make no, sacrifices yeah. for the Coke. <laughs> Mm, yeah, they are good. It's like 97 cents a bag versus four bucks from Lay's. Big difference. Yeah. Right? Um, yeah, my preference is still Ruffles. They just got the right, just the right uh, balance, I find. Yeah. For my person, for my taste anyway. But yeah, before when Ruffles wasn't doing the something vinegar, um, yeah, I way preferred the uh, no name over Lay's. Lay's sucks. Ships are expensive in Canada only? No cheap grocery shaming. <laughs> hey. Pizza stolen MMs. I'm a mouth breather. So I can't chew with my mouth closed. Hey Tiff. It's true. Well, I'm hoping that doesn't happen. This bag was 97 cents, and if you buy name brand chips, it's like four bucks or two for six. What kind of promotion is that? Save five cents. You ever seen like some promotions are so stupid? Girl, I go to Maxi. No shame. <laughs> We love ketchup. Yes, we love ketchup. <laughs> I said Canadians must love ketchup flavored things. I always forget that the ketchup chips aren't a thing. Hi, Dr. Phil. <laughs> what? I was saying, I always forget that ketchup chips aren't really a thing in the US. CB, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. You guys have all the breath. You are Canadian, Amsterdam? You don't like ketchup? Mmm. Peas. Yeah. Can I have some of your m and Leave us freaking m, -M, m ms alone. That's pathetic. Um, Stackish Nelson, N Nelsonson, thank you. Um, what is Maxi? Okay, Maxi and Super C are the, like, discount grocery stores in Quebec. So no discount grocery shaming me and Fanny, okay? Fine, but you have to go get them. Just yeah, me saying you have to go get them is as good as saying you can't have them. Oh. There's some on the counter. I can get them. Why don't I just buy my own? Kate, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. I really appreciate it. I mean, it's a scientifically proven fact that stolen food tastes better. You have a witty answer for everything. I like that. Not everything. You'll send me a whole bunch of M&Ms? That's so sweet of you. I think people seriously hate me. There's 1,200 people watching and I only have 53 likes. Sense. What do you mean? You said you, you said a little Amanda Lynn, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. <laughs> I mean, you were going through a rough time. Did you want me to just straight up tell you you're a trash train wreck? <laughs> As a friend, yes. I'm kidding. You are very lovely. Aw, thank you. Well, ketchup or chips? No, they taste like uh, they don't taste like real actual ketchup. I don't know how to explain how they taste. <laughs> Call me <proud. laughs> Oh, thanks, weed witch. <laughs> Three fifty-six. 
I hope not. That's a big weight gain. People want to see your sword. I don't think we're allowed to show Kiwi it. Cowgirl, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. No idea. Probably not real weapons. This is like a decorative sword. Oh, good cheeseburgers. CB, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. But guys, we're not going to snipe. Oh, Christ. <laughs> she's live. She's live. Tonight. Okay. So we're going to go snipe another boring stream. Like, this is the problem with Chantal. This is the juicy stream. We're going to go and snipe. What What's she doing? Sitting, looking like trash, not apologizing, being the same asshole she always is? I don't know. I don't know. Which sound clip? Is it Pete's sound clip? I'll put up a poll. How's that? Okay. If it's boring, we can come right back. And I mean right back. Because this has not even gotten to the juicy part yet. And it yeah. gets juicy. That's depression, right? Yep. What are you thinking about right now? Nothing in particular. Pretty much just random shit going through my brain. Look how terrible this is. Amanda Lynn, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it, girl. He's thinking about Knights of the Old Republic. Uh, Foodie Flasher says, hope your depression improves soon, Pete. Um, it's not cute. Mm. Did you hear her? <clears throat> no, say what you got to say here, Curly. If it's about me and it's not cute, I don't care. Come on, come on. I'm an open book. Bye, Bam. <laughs> there you go. See? What? Know what you're doing there. Okay, we're going to end the poll, guys. So vote now or forever hold your peace. Oh, my God. It's like, it's pretty close. So please vote. Today. You guys want to go eat soon? Let me plug this in. <clears throat> Popped an X today for the 20th time. So how long till I go back? No, I'm not. Hi, Jody. No, I'm not getting you pecan pie. What are you going to do for me? <laughs> I'm just joking. Actually, pecan pie sounds so good. CB, never mind. She's literally talking about Nashies. What? <laughs> What's wrong with Nashies? I want Nashies. Can I share? Pecan pie used to be my favorite pie. I think key lime pie is now my favorite pie. 
Nobody kicked PBJ. PBJ! Nobody kicked PBJ? What? Oh. Nobody's going to hurt my PBJ. Oh my god, StreamYard, do you guys want, to, want me to do that later? We could have a beating time later. Key, Look at where democracy got you. I'm falling asleep. I'm putting up a new pool. Yeah. Um. Just one message. Just send me one message and that's it. So... Yep. I am done. Done. Oh my God, it's 9-11? No, it's the 10th today. What's the date today? Is it not the 10th? <clears throat> no, I have a new necklace now. <laughs> Look. Everybody vote because I'm gonna end it. I think I. Where did I, I? I think I remember like ripping off the necklace and just like. I've been Mario Beezing alone. Being unemployed is weird. Mario Beezing alone. Uh, I gotta change that. You threw it to your left. <laughs> to the left. To the left. East side Mario's. What? <clears throat> I yeeted? What does yeeted mean? Okay, it's the 10th. That's what I thought. No, 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 no. All right, that, that's what I call democracy in action. Mistakes were made. We got the F out of there. <laughs> we're going back to the T. You hear her? You hear her? Mm -hmm. She loves it. No, BBJ. Mm -hmm. Well, can you just tell me what it is, Chloe? I'm on a live stream. Look at that. We were sitting on that boring live. Okay. And we come back here and we're about to hit the juicy part. So this, this mysterious person comes into the chat last night. Some curly something. Okay. Is trying to like send Chantel some like screenshots and some, some, some bod, some, some, some cokey. Okay. She's been messaging with cokey. There's pictures of cokey and she's trying to get them to Chantal. And this is where we resume. <laughs> no, she runs and hides. What can we do to cheer you up? Hmm? Yeah. Agent Dana Scully. Was your grandma passed away yesterday? What are we today? Huh? What are we today? Thursday. Good night. Oh my god, it's two in the morning, Pete. Yep. Let me know what it makes you. For the love of God, it is not me, I swear. <laughs> yes. I have no shame. I, I, I don't hide behind nothing. I, if I want to go in, I go in FFG. That's just the way I am. We got to bug me. Hey. Go 
don't. I want chicken and rice. He's in the street. How can he be? What? Are you sure it's the right person? Okay. So, so Koki is like now, now sending messages. And well, he's in the street. Are you sure it's the right person? Ma'am, he's not in the street. Koki isn't as destitute as you think. He just hides what he's got from you because he's playing you. Okay. And while you think, oh, he's in the street and maybe he's going to come. and I don't know. I need to say for it. He doesn't give two shits. He's literally already sending pictures to another woman. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's see the screenshots then. <clears throat> I need more cheese. <laughs> Get your popcorn out. I need some more cheese for this and olives. You think so? Hmm. Screenshots or it didn't happen. Anyway, who cares? Okay, hold up, because she's been getting screenshots of shit all summer. It never stopped anything. So screenshots or it didn't happen, and even if I get screenshots, I don't care. I just like the D, and I like when men look at me. Abby Emerson, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. I really appreciate it. He's a dirt bag, so who cares? <laughs> He's all yours. Mm. Um, I don't know, Brandy. I mean, I don't really know. I don't know. Um, yeah. My email is big beautiful me m e e at gmail dot com. I highly doubt that, but I want to see. Good for you, Curly. Do you want a medal? Like, <laughs> what's your point? <laughs> Everyone, give Curly a medal for have buying her shoes somewhere other than Walmart. I need more cheese. Tell Pete I say hi. Abby says hi. Hi. Yeah, Abby, you want to go to box dance? Here you go. Your side, Pew Pew. I don't know, Marissa. I didn't answer his phone call. I'm not sure. What is CL? I don't even know what the fuck that is. Let's see if this pizza is good. Stay strong. Stay strong. Trying. Remember the pizza from yesterday? Do you think it's still a good pizza? Probably. Really? I don't know. I put it in the fridge. See, that was me being a diplomat all summer. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. When maybe it's just all of us, fuck. But no, no, let me take the heat. Maybe it's just me. <laughs> I hate myself. It's Graham's pizza. I guess you didn't want it, Graham. <laughs> What happened, Marissa? 
Okay, I swear to God, I swear to God, I said a long time ago, if I ever go missing, you should look out for English baked boy. I figured that would be the exact opposite of French fried girl. Wink. <laughs> Why do you eat so much? Because I'm a fat ass. Mmm. I don't blame you, Marcel. Have a good night. Mmm. We'll talk tomorrow. <clears throat> Diplomatic asshole again. <laughs> You're an idiot. Thanks, Marcia. Hmm. Hard, I am. What? I am. You look hard. I am. Are you gonna sleep? Not just yet. Why are you fighting? <laughs> I don't want to sleep yet. <laughs> Amy, thank you. He's been calling me this whole like yeah, he called me a few times. Uh, di diplomacy is over. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, With her, anyway. Yeah, I haven't gotten an email yet, Lily. Ever. Chantel, you should do makeup videos. I blend eyeshadow. <laughs> is that a joke? I don't blend eyeshadow well. That better be a joke. That what she gonna show us how to put on the fucking glitter or the charmuta black? No thanks. Give me my finger. And it's actually not blended at all. What is that? Cheese cheese wrapper. You do a great job, really. Thank you. What do you want to talk about? Mm. I got nothing. I think I'm going to go lay down. Dude. Really? problem with blocking people um liar and boar i didn't call curly a liar did i no i said i didn't think so but i apologize no i don't want it to be private curly i want it to be out that's what i said whatever you got <laughs> make 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 me mad at him Ma'am, everything he's done for the past four months should be enough to make you mad at him. You don't need your chat to make you mad at him. And stop asking them to. Inappropriate. You're not a fucking kid, man. 37-year-old woman, don't ask the chat for shit. The fact that they pay all your rent and bills and cookies and blah, blah, blah. It's enough. I think they've done quite enough. Graham is going to be hungry if I eat her pizza. Graham does not like... She loves Greek pizza. She doesn't like red onions. I forgot about that. Well, whenever I confronted him about the messaging of the girls, he said that he likes to play with people. It's not serious. You love the Chantel show? Grams loves Perkins. Maybe we should have Perkins do a Perkins for Grams, what she used to eat. She used to eat half a BLT and, and two pancakes. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. Make me mad. Make me fucking mad. As if what I fucking went through wasn't enough. Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. It only wasn't enough for you, okay? I don't know too many people who would have stuck around. 
again, when a perfect stranger, when somebody you've known less than a week turned around and smacked you for the first time, I'm going to guess 98% of people would have left. That leaves you in one other sucker. That's pretty pathetic. I know. No, it's not okay. Messaging other girls. That's right, B. If we're not in a relationship, right? We're not. But. Still tells me he doesn't talk to people. It's, it's still lying for me. Just be fucking honest about it if you are. This is months back. This is back to like June. Back to when she was ready to do the B&E and &E in Gatineau. Same dialogue. Wouldn't be as big a deal. I'm not stupid. I know he probably talks to girls, but don't lie about it. Anyways. Thank you, Jojo. No. <laughs> Show me the other screenshots. Did you send them? Oh. Uh, Jojo used to be. You sent them? I feel like puking all over his face. <laughs> Hold on. I sent him the screenshot and I'm like, what the fuck? You're sick. I'm like, fuck you. What kind of drama is this? Let's go back to mukbangs. Okay. You know, like, obviously, I don't believe that she that this is over. Obviously. Okay. Now, that was another tell. Why the fuck would she be texting him the screenshots? Who gives a shit? You don't have to show him shit. And if you were actually done with him, you wouldn't be showing him shit. You would have already been blocked, or you would have already blocked, and it would have been done, right? The fact that you said, mm, "What is this, you piece of shit?" and sending this up, pathetic. That's a play. So forget. I feel so like, ugh. <laughs> What's creepy is like the message was like, "Show, show me the girl," but she has to like big dick. Like, show me the girl. Like, what, are you in the fucking sex traffic or something? Like, what's going... Like, what? That sounds, like, so weird to me. Anyway. Sex traffic. Everything has to be, like, buzzwords with her. Maybe I'm, Maybe it's just my opinion, but that sounds more like tramuta activities to me than trafficking. Like, that sounds like, like a hooker. No? Yes. Oh, anyways. Make me mad. Make me mad. Sorry. A Meeks. Who else did I miss? Hold on, I'll give you your arm shake, Meeks. Did I miss anyone else? You have more pics of him video chatting? Yeah, but is it like sexual stuff for real? Like recently? I need all the proof. I need all the proof. Okay. This is another thing that just blows my fucking mind. Why is she so much more bothered by him like messaging with another girl than that he beat her? Maybe I have fucked up priorities, but I would say the beating would be more important to me. That would be what I was outraged about. What is wrong with me? Do you know what I did for this fucking scumbag? Never mind.
Anyways. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Purple mermaid. All right, you guys. Yeah. What was I getting out of it? Fantasy. Nothing real. And that's where the stress came in when you try to make something fake real. But, 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 fantasy where? Fantasy where? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. Sorry, not sorry. Fuck Koki. He's got literally nothing going for him. Nothing. Look at every aspect of his life. Superficial, behind the scenes, what he's all about, his personality, that bunk ass fucking mouth he's got, that skinny little crackhead physique. Okay. <laughs> what fantasy? Holy shit. I don't know. That is certainly not the picture of, uh, Prince Charming that I ever had in my fantasy. The fuck? Dana Peterson, thank you so much for the super chat, girl. Lord in a landslide. Expose him. I feel, seriously feel like telling my story. Because you know what? You just fucking... Never mind. I don't need this shit right now. I feel like I don't know him at all. You know, one time I did that to Bibi, I had a girl with an unknown number message him. I told you that, eh? And was like, hey, do you want to hook up? I met, remember me, I'm really hot or whatever. And he's like, sorry, I'm in love with my girlfriend. That's so gross. That is so gross. She was already, what, in her mid-20s? At the earliest? And she's playing those sick little games, trying to trap her boyfriend to see if he would... It is so gross. I want to tell him off though. I want to call him and be like, why the fuck are you messaging? Why were you, what? I paid his rent. Oh, 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 excuse me, what? <laughs> excuse me, ma'am, you paid his rent? Because I thought I was a liar. Oh, that's funny. Hmm. Everything. You know what? But only once. Allegedly, conspiracy, I don't know if this is true, this is secondhand information, but I was told, I was told that Koki has been bragging that she paid his, uh, she paid his rent May, June, July, and now the August, September double up to pay, okay? But allegedly, conspiracy, whatever, she's been paying since May, Like it for July, I paid July and then I didn't pay August or September. Well, technically. Then Nikki expects me to pay and I'm on. Fuck you. 
No, I didn't, Kels, I swear. I said my wallet went missing. Remember when I called that, when she lost her wallet? Lost her wallet. And I said that, oh, I don't think she lost her wallet. I think this was a play to hide the money. Yeah. Oop. She's so fucking predictable. But that is like the oldest crackhead game in the book. So no shocker there. <laughs> it's in my room. I look in there, his landlord came over. I, I, okay. I had to lie to you about the wallet. I had to make it public. <sighs> no, no, you didn't have to lie about the wallet. You didn't have to make it public because let me tell you, Chantal, maybe there's a handful of Beezers who bought that bullshit, but we didn't buy it. Most of your audience didn't buy it. And let me tell you that the hustler, Koki, the crackhead himself, certainly didn't buy it. Come on, ma'am. That was so fucking obvious. And Koki, the hustling addict, would have known that exact game. He's probably played it five or six times in his life. Sorry about that. <laughs> Busy watches and smart. I'm fucking smarter than you. Actually, no, I better not. I better not do this because he can show up here. For real, like he's scared. Like I'm scared of him. Like for real. So I'm just gonna shut up. Actually, Curly, I'm really glad you sent me that because yeah, I can talk a big game and be like, oh, I'm not in a relationship, but you guys know I'm fucking jealous. And you guys know if I knew, I don't know. Like I say, oh, I, it's okay. I'm lying to myself. I would have a problem with it, especially when I'm fucking. You're, I'm supporting you. And you disrespect me like that? Like, go fuck yourself. That's not true at all. All she would do is find out the information, go to Koki. Be, is this true? He would go, no. She would go, okay. She just wants to believe. She wants to believe everything he says, right? She knows damn right. It's pathetic. All the way and have fun. Have fun finding somebody on Mary Avenue to pay your fucking bills. Okay. Have fun. So that was her just confirming the docs that Kiwi Farms had put out his address. Well done, Chantal. Uh, Keep talking. I still have my, I still have $900 in my wallet. No, I'm not going to tell him off. You're right. It's not good to do that. Mm. Yeah. Hi, Budget Sativa. Well, the dog's working on it. I'm just saying, <laughs> as a joke. Pamela Clarkson, welcome to Grand Point Beezers. Ready to send bees. Your silence will hurt him the most. Yeah. Anyway. Anyways. The opposite of love, yeah, it's not hate. It's indifference. Love and hate are very closely related, aren't they? Yeah, you're right, Lydia. I'm just gonna like not get worked up. And try not to act immature and just, you know what I mean? Just, sorry. <laughs> no, I was just really like, I'm sorry. I just got really mad. I've just been through, I'm just coming to like realization of stuff, guys. So if I seem like, no, nobody has a health key. No. I've been really mad. I've just been through so much, ma'am. You, you haven't really been through so much. You put yourself through so much. Pathetic. I have no more pity for this bullshit. Oh, I'm so done, Volpe. I'm actually like super grossed out. Like I'm like, I 
Oh, we've I heard this Wiley. before in I June. Feel I do. I feel like. Mm. I wish this never happened. Why passion, Tim? He probably uses multiple women. Yeah. He's a fucking loser. So now he's a loser, but when she's going to try and get back with him and try and convince us again of what, what a great person he is, and we just don't know him and blah, 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 how she's going to spin this because she really threw him under the bus. I can't wait to see how she's going to spin this one and turn him back into Prince Charming again. He was saying he'd never talked to any other girls. Like, he's saying that he, like, whenever, like, people message him, like, my my fans or whatever he's like it's your fault you tell them i have a nice dick and then women message me so i just answer just to you know play with them and see if it's them or whatever i'm not stupid i know he's lying about stuff can you imagine a cheater telling you it's your fault because you told everyone i have a nice dick dude we see your fucking teeth you know you know unlike chantal who seems obsessed with just the d Maybe I'm only speaking for myself, but I tend to look at everything else that's attached to that D. And when it's as janky as you are, dude, nobody cares how big, how small, how thin, how cracked out it is. Nobody, nobody wants to touch that disgusting fucking thing or any other part of you. He thinks I'm dumb. I just never thought, like, I'm naive. I don't believe... Even fully 100% now, I can't believe that somebody would do that to another person. I just don't believe it. Like the manipulation is, if, if, if it's true, the manipulation is fucking, yeah. No, I believe you, Curly. I believe you. People are heartless. I think like evil, like he's like evil. Yeah, Liliana, it is true. No, I just mean not the screen. I mean, like. <sighs> yeah, Angel Wings. That's what it seems like. What the fuck? Why am I in this situation? Because you're desperate. Come on. You put yourself. Again, now why am I in this situation? The victim. The victim didn't have any of this coming or didn't ask for any of this. Get the fuck out of here. Yes, he did say that. He says some other pretty fucked up things. I hope that's not him. Oh, peeping out the window, acting all paranoid. Get the hell out of here. It's a mess. Furry biscuit. Welcome to Bird Bird Beezers. Ready, set, beast, furry biscuit. Can you share your story? I just thought that's a little, I can't believe. What do you mean, Amix? What do you mean? No, I'm keeping an eye out. I don't want to close the blinds fully. Pull incoming. Okay, I'm going to do a little bit more edibles. And then I promise tomorrow I'm going to do them. I don't think I'm going to need them after I drop this fucking load off of my body. Remember, I never used to, I never had anxiety this bad. I'm blaming it on him. Fuck that. No, I swear. I'm serious. Everything is locked, but my lock is flimsy. It'll be okay, I think. Vote, please. He says a sword. I fucking use it, I swear to God. Don't ever come near me again. Oh, Punisher, you're sweet. I have a feeling there was someone there today, too. You'll have more money. <laughs> you're right. That's like the biggest thing. So true. So true.
I don't know. People are saying it it got interesting. So maybe we dip in, maybe we check. If it's boring, we we bounce again. Yay. Up to you guys. I don't believe in that anymore. That's what happened. My hair will grow back. Cat Tom, is his attention really worth your hard earned money? No. I'm not going to lie. I feel really fucking hurt right now. Like, oh my God. Just something one after another. Oh. So she's really hurt right now because Koki might be messaging another girl. Spoiler alert, he messages lots of people. Um, but she wasn't so hurt when he beats the shit out of her. That's okay. Or when he just assumes without asking that he's she's going to pay two months rent for him. That's also okay. But this, oh, I'm so hurt. The fuck, man? The fuck? I know, I kind of want to stay alive, like, until, like, I feel safer. Okay, she's on the phone, apparently, with Koki right now. So we'll wait. We'll let the pool marinate a minute. We'll stay here, and we'll see, okay? I should fuck someone else on channel on this channel. Sorry, that was rude. I should make out with someone on the... Anyone want to make out? Like, just meet up and make out, just, for, just to piss Dom off. I'm just kidding. Never mind, that's good. My heart feels broken. I feel like, what did I do to deserve this? Get new hobbies, travel, be happy, find new friends, a new guy. Okay, I don't like Chantal, and this is not me dipl being diplomatic. This is me being honest here. You didn't do anything to deserve this, okay? At all. Nobody deserves this kind of shit. But you chose to stay in it. So please don't turn around now. What did I do to deserve this and play victim? Okay. No, you chose to stay. Everyone yelling at you. What a stupid mistake this was. You know better than everyone. That's why you're where you're at right now. You don't get to play victim. Have more money. Sky's the limit without him in the picture. That makes me smile, Sandy, actually. <laughs> Two weeks will be fine. In a few weeks, I'll just bees until I feel better. Messaging girls on my phone that I paid for. I'm such a fucking idiot. <laughs> I forgot how stupid that is. I forgot all about that. Oh my God. Not only is he messaging other girls on her phone, she pays the phone bill. Oh, that is fucking hilarious. Holy moly. I love it. I forgot all about that. Wow. I'm an idiot. Oh my God. He's an asshole. It's not funny. It's not funny. I'm going to cancel the phone. I am. As soon as I get off here, I'm not even kidding. Ah, okay, we already have a pull up, so I can't do two pulls, unfortunately, because I would put up a pull right now. How much you want to bet she didn't cancel shit? She's the type of woman, not only she didn't cancel the phone, if she, if anything, she went and like added him more data because maybe he'll love me if I pay more of a phone bill for him. Oh, she is that kind of a pick me. Ugh. I'm never, are you kidding? You think I'm going to go back after all this fucking shit? I'm so pissed off. Like, not, not no. Can I see the call logs? Can I check all that? Oh, I'm sure he's I got know, a real nice like, phone that he keeps on I've the never, side. I don't know. Like, I feel like I've taken my glasses off. I don't know if it's the shrooms or what. Petty princess, bestie, it wasn't real. He doesn't care. Boss up. Yeah, boss up. That's what I got to keep telling myself. Oh my God, you guys. I am very blind. I don't want to think about everything. No. I'm sorry. I don't accept blind as the word there. You're not blind. Blind assumes that you didn't see. You might have been blind, but you had people show you. Shannon showed you. 
I showed you. And that's just two that we know. Maybe BB, allegedly, conspiracy. I don't know if it's BB. I still have a feeling that every time she said she's speaking to BB, she was talking to her aunt. Okay. You knew you were not blind. You chose to close your eyes. That's not blind. That's just dumb. Different things there. Ew, what is that? BBK. You Thank was... you for the update, Herxy. I really appreciate it, girl. I don't feel like I should talk about something so heavy, like just hastily. Maybe I should like wait a bit until like like the next day. Oh fuck, no, no one's gonna. If you're not like BB, then I'm not. I'm not dating you, BB or Pete. Those bloody rose colored glass. I swear to God. Oh. No, Ronnie. Um, he didn't cancel on me. What happened was, like, what I told you guys, I drove there, picked him up, and as I was pulling away from his house, like, a little up the road, he said, I'm like, you're going to come to my house? So I'm like, so you're going to come to my house, cat here Central? Because whenever, that's another thing that fucking annoys me. He's always, like, <laughs> hawking up fucking hairballs and shit. <laughs> Choke. No. So um, he's like, so you go home. So do you, like, go home and clean some of the hair, just the cat hair. And I'll go give my ID. My friend left his ID at my house. I'm going to, it's on the way to your house. Or something. It was a fucking Vanier. And I live in Orleans. So so I'm like, oh, okay. That made me a bit crabby. Because that, that annoys me when he's always like, he makes me go to shady places to go to his friends. I don't know what he's doing. He's giving me some fucking bullshit reason. I don't know. Girl. Girl. <laughs> you go into shady places to go and see his shady friends. And you know damn right what you're doing there. You're going to do pick up and drop offs with him. You know. I know. Everybody knows this is pretty fucking obvious what's been going on. Okay? We all fucking know. Please. We can't end the bullshit in a big way today. Ugh. Anyway. So then I drop him off. Yeah, so that's what he said. I'm like, well, how are you going to get to my house? My friend's going to bring me to your house after. So then what happened was I dropped him off, but then somehow that's when all that confusion happened. I don't know. I started Holy getting bad shit, vibes, dude. even just driving. I, I, so many times I was like, go back home, go back home, go back home. And I was like, going to go back home and go live and be like, hey guys, I I'm back home. And then I'm thinking to myself, and I, I'm thinking, you're not going to do it. You're not going to turn around. You're not going to go home. And I'm thinking, why am I lying to myself? Like, why am I fucking lying to myself? So anyways, I ended up somehow driving all the way back towards to his area of town excuse me, towards his house, but realizing it, that's where I was like, what, you know, so then, and I knew this would happen, I knew it, I'm like, I bet you any money, he doesn't even have a ride back to my house, I'm gonna have to go fucking get him, because he's a fucking bum, of course, <laughs> sorry, uh, again, uh, I hate to tell her I told you so, but I said that she's on the cop's radar in June, yeah, and she lives in a small town. Well, small town. I shit on Ottawa all the time. I'm sorry, Ottawa. I'm sorry to shit on you. But it's a pretty small city. You know, the cops aren't too busy. They have plenty of time to watch out for her. Of course. He fucking calls me. That's when I ended my stream. I'm outside. I'm like, what? I already told you anyway. So no, he didn't cancel on me. He Well, I don't know where he is in some shady part of town somewhere. I don't know where I dropped him. So I left him in the street. I'm not going to drive up. I did edibles and shrooms because you said you're getting a ride here. I don't even want you here anyways to begin with. Yeah, that's a lie. She so wants him here. I don't like you. If my cats don't like you, there's a fucking problem. What happened, Black Beauty? What the heck? Sorry, I'm just babbling away. Tinder sucks. Try Christian Mingle, CIB. When you're wearing rose-colored glasses, all the red flags just look like flags. Oh, fuck. Tell me about it. Cancel the phone. You're right. Oh, my God. I gotta cancel my fucking phone. He just needs a charge that'll get him two years. He's not a citizen yet. If he goes to prison, not jail, when you come out, they, they try to do deportation against you, and they usually get the deportation. He needs something that sends him to prison. 
two years, two years, even two years plus a day enough has to be heavy. Like, let's say, for example, let's just use the example of the situation we're in, because again, gloves are off, not gloves are off. This isn't to be a bitch, but these are things that I've been thinking for months. He beats her. He beats her a little. He knocks her around. He gets arrested. That's just jail. He beats her so bad she ends up in the hospital and they can try and tack on attempted murder charges. That could be prison. And that could possibly be the end of Koki and this whole fucking problem. Just saying. Not that I wish that on anyone, but I thought of it. Or if they get pulled over and he's got the amount of speed, allegedly, conspiracy, whatever, the amount of speed that he usually keeps at his apartment, oops, that could be prison also, depending on how much they're moving. I'm lying about what? Yeah, Brandy, it's all to pay for. He ended up shooting you? Oh my God, I'm so sorry, CIB. Yours are scary. I don't know, Monica. That's like, I don't know why he's messaging people. It's concerning. <sighs> oh, that's already long done, Falik. <laughs> <laughs> what an idiot like, like why would he mess like does he not know that i'm a public figure people are obviously going to message me screenshots of him being a douchebag ma'am doesn't he know i'm like a public figure <laughs> um you're not like famous like that ma'am he doesn't give a shit also i think that's important to remember she always talks about him like oh well he's gonna get caught and i'm his girlfriend and he should give a shit about getting caught he doesn't all it means if he gets caught is that he has to find another sucker to pay his rent next month. It's the, the only difference in his day. What? No, it, make, it makes us a troll. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> what are you talking about? Anyway, let's just be easy and have fun. Oh, yeah, fun after that. Oh, my God. And we're not done yet. Can we do that, please? Can I put lipstick on? Close your eyes. What color? Doesn't matter. I'm dressing up for you guys. Cancel the phone. Yeah, Melissa, I think that's going to happen, too. I want to call right now and see what this Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm going to pause right here and say Raven Lunatic. I don't believe that for a heartbeat for a bunch of reasons. Number one, she doesn't know any people, okay? You need to have people to chop to. She doesn't know any people who she's going to sell it to. Number two, even if she had Cokie's custies or whatever, she would get robbed 16 times a day. She can't defend herself. She can't chase after someone. She can't do jack shit. She would be a literal sitting duck. A sucker of a deal. There is no way, no fucking way that they would have her dealing. No. And the only way she's allowed to move stuff back and forth with her car is if Koki's in the car next to her because she's also an addict who loves to exaggerate. And I don't think they would get the entire shipment, let's say, on the other end if Koki wasn't in the car. They just use her for the lift. Excuses. <sighs> Thank you. What time is it? Three? Oh my God, <laughs> look at it. That's too pale, this lipstick, eh?
don't hear any of it. That's what happens to me. I always wait for some kind of like valid, um, a little shimmer, like some kind of valid excuse, like explain yourself. Like I want there to be some reason, <laughs> obviously. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. So she looks for valid excuses for him to explain himself. Here's the problem. Some of the stuff I told her on the phone, she's now repeated on this stream. The stabbing, the ex-girlfriend who died on the trap house floor, they go into jail, blah, blah, blah. So you found that stuff out. You went to him. His justification wasn't even really like an excuse. Okay. He fessed up to everything to you, but that's still okay. So no matter what he had said, no matter what he had said, you wouldn't have left. That is insane. I wonder if he had answered by stabbing you, would you have left then? Hmm, who knows? Because it hurts, you know? I was getting fucked over by people. Humans are flawed. That's all there is to it. Humans are flawed. I'm using one of these. I don't like this color. I'm going to switch to this, I think. Uh. <laughs> Misha. Yeah. <laughs> he wants you to call for his mission. You think he's watching me right now? Obviously. Maybe that's why. Unless he's busy. <laughs> Maybe that's why he's messaging people to get me mad. Sweetie. I'm just very confused. Sad. Hurt. <laughs> CB, thank you so much for the super chat. Damn, girl, you really watched that shit live? Oh my, I was sleeping. But I woke up at 4.30 and, oh boy. Really? What does he say? Oh, the gloss is pretty. Thank you, Felic. <laughs> Shut up, guys. I want Liliana. I think. No. <laughs> Cancel the phone. I can't do it right now. I'm on my phone. 4.30. Excuse me. <laughs> I'm going to remember this. I'm just a casual yeah. killer, not a serial killer. It's the difference. Okay. That half an hour makes all the difference. She's looking at me like. Oh, Passionton. Can you speak this phone? No, I have to log into my thing, guys. I will. Joe, I can't the phone. <laughs> Joe just messaging. Oh, my God. You oh, yeah, really of course. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, hang on. We had a poll going, and the poll lasted so long that she ended the stream. <laughs> so we missed nothing. But she apparently was on a call for a, quite a long time, and then ended the stream and just took off. So, yeah, I think she's going back to Koki. Like last time, right? We needed to talk. I need to talk. I need closure. Get the... Oh, my God. 
People, I'm sorry, okay? Again, maybe this is just my opinion. People who go through this kind of shit, this kind of shit, and come up with, I needed closure. No, you just needed an excuse to get back over there. That's what you needed. There's no fucking closure in a, a shit fest like this. Come on. I legit thought this guy was like not messaging any women, was like being really honest with me. Oh my God, I'm such an idiot. Same. Good point. Unless she's going there to bring him his $900. If you stay away from him, I'll give you a thousand towards your obese. Oh my God. How can I turn that down? <laughs> you guys must have seen and see th something I, I didn't. So um, I apologize if I was blind, but no, 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 no. Again, you guys saw something that I didn't. Fine. That would be an excuse at the beginning. But a lot of people have been throwing it in your face. I, the, oh, Guys, can you imagine? Can you just, just put yourself in her, in her shoes the night of our phone call. And somebody tells you this guy has stabbed an ex-girlfriend, gone to jail. The other one has died on the fucking crack house floor. And even that, okay allegedly conspiracy whatever dom took over that dead ex-girlfriend's facebook page that's really really sus and weird and maybe not sus but there's something very very strange about that to me i can't put my finger on it i can't figure out why the hell he would have done that but that is extremely weird to me I don't know if it's true. That's according to Kiwi Farms, okay? I read that on Kiwi Farms, and I've read that on Twitter. Very weird, but I assume verifiable, right? You go, apparently, his second Facebook page, the, the link still, it's like her name, the link. Weird. Like, like used it and, like, is still active on it. Like, uses it. Weird, very weird to me. Oh, her name is the is his URL. There you go. That was her account. That is so weird to me. I don't know what it is. I don't know why. Why did they fall for him? I wanted him to love. Yeah, I guess I did. I wanted to love me, but. I'll give you 2,000, but I'll give you 200. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. That's so funny. Think of how many guys there are in Europe, right? I just want to be treated good. I don't want to be cheated on. I don't want to be taken advantage of just because I'm big. Ma'am, why is that the priority? Oh, my God. For real. Why is that the priority? I just don't want to be beat. How's that? Am I nuts that that would be the first thing I would have come out with before cheated on, taken advantage of? I don't want to be hit. I don't want to be abused. I never want to be touched again like that. That would be my priority. Or whatever. I don't know what, why. Maybe it's nothing to do with me. I don't think it has anything to do with me, actually. You know what it is? No. I'm not the only one this happens to. Job. Yes. He was untrue, rolling her around in the car. What? I bought you, gave you a job, then keys for it before your house Is that um allegedly cocaine induced? Not really overdose, but cocaine induced heart attack. Allegedly. Who knows? The truth. Who knows? This is what I've heard. Allegedly. <laughs> I wish I went with Le Manlet. He was nice at least. Beach Life One Day. Thank you so much for the super chat, girl.
Here we come. You're in 2200 already. Woo woo. You're obese. Talking about how I'll never ever find a man like you. Thanks, guys. No, I'm really like over. I'm surprised. Like, am I just like higher? There's so much support. Like, you guys were. Like, you guys are so. I feel like a big sigh of relief on your end. <laughs> like, I don't. <laughs> anyway, it's <laughs> And you guys know so much about like somebody like who do you I'm trying to worry about him, I'm trying to worry about him. Like how do you know him? Like I tried to warn you about him. I tried to warn you about him. How do you know, ma'am? I told you exactly for me. I can't I can't speak for everyone else who tried to warn you, but I told you exactly how I knew on the phone. Okay. Um she knew. She knew damn right I told her. I've never met him. We have mutuals. The mutuals I heard all kinds of shit. Okay. And the mutuals <laughs> let me know what cokie has been talking about her behind her back. And I let her know. So she knew she had all the information in front of her eyes. She's still getting all the fucking information in front of her eyes. And th this is the thing, like the people now are sending her the stuff about him cheating. And I get that. Like that would piss me off too. I told her stuff about protecting your life. It's, that would have alarmed me a hell of a lot more than some schmuck I barely know is cheating on me. But again, that's just me. Priorities, right? Staying alive is always my priority. I'm out of his league. My ex used to make my feel like I am ugly. He was on the inside. Yeah, it makes me want to throw up. I wanted you to leave him from the beginning. We'll never... Forget him threatening you, like, yeah. And I didn't even tell you about our fight, <laughs> you would be horrified. And he blamed it on me. <sighs> 13 years, wow, purple mermaid. I'm so sorry. Uh, smells like like tide. Let me go with that for you. Controlling, yes. If the eviction is in French, that means he's in Quebec. That's just more confirmation. It wouldn't be in, uh, in French if it was in Ontario. He's in Gatineau. Yeah, I feel punched in the gut. What do you feel scared? Vegas doll? Really, Lindsay? You met someone like him? Well, then everyone deserves second chances. I really was giving him another chance, but he's 40, unmarried, jobless, and a drug addict. Sarah Kate, it's all well the bruises we've seen in the last couple months, where they from him. You girl, keep your head up. Not, um, no. Um, well, okay, yes, but <clears throat> I don't really want to talk about this right now, I don't think. She does look like his ex, same size, the big story, and more than that, like they, they do kind of look alike. I won't want to talk about it when I'm sober. <laughs> He's in chill. I don't know, Liliana, that's why I don't know. I don't know. One's in the chat if you've gotten just... naked with Koki on stream. <laughs> he 
The family member said what? They're just... They got all dressed up. Well, someone else will deserve my lingerie in the future, right? Uh, send them to me. Send them to me. I will literally translate on the fly. I'll read through them and tell you what they, what it is in English. Yeah, phallic. Pushing until it just want drama. Yeah. I'm going to just wait and... Thank you, Misha. I have uh, the lashes. Do you guys not find lashes make all the difference, hey? And I have my hair down and washed. Is it too soon? <laughs> His bad teeth I can live with. Treat me well and I don't care really what you look like. I don't know, he's stupid. Like, I mean, I guess maybe he's not attracted to me. I don't know why he would treat me like that. But whatever. It's not about me anymore. Thinking, maybe he's not attracted to me. Why would he treat me like that? We have been saying this to you since a April, April 26th, I believe. I might be off a day or two. This isn't about attraction. This isn't a relationship on his end anyway. Ma'am, he doesn't give two shits. This was a hustle. This has always been a hustle. This will always be a hustle. You are still the sucker. Nothing has changed. You just still don't get it. Pathetic. Maybe he's not attracted to me. Obviously. More. Never treated me well yet. No. I think I need to call him. I need an answer. Or no. Should I just not? I need to know. I need closure. Or is that just me wanting to like, I don't know. No. Riley Rose, you literally called me at 2.47 p.m. today and wanted pics of me. I wanted to send me some. Open your eyes, but he uses you for money. He said, money. Thanks, Riley. Oh, my God. Wow. Like, what? Sorry, Peggy. Sorry, sorry. I didn't see. Oi. Um, yeah, my, that's my email. Frenchfriedgirl at gmail.com. All one word. Send to me gruel. Yeah, and you know what else? I like. I had a feeling there was someone there today. I want to cancel the phone like right now. I fucking hate him. Oh. Let me tell you about that night. So oh, oh, you can tell when she's rocking with rage. She's rocking with rage. And now let me tell you about that night. All right, girl, still. Oh, I can tell you. And then you can tell me how bad it was. And then you can tell me, I can't believe you ignored this. <clears throat> I don't think that it's that he wasn't attracted to you. I just think he doesn't respect women. Yeah, I don't think so either. Calls them like whores and stuff. I don't know. You call for help, I guess, all? Okay, guys, hang on. She just came back live in a stream called I'm Okay. Do we go in? Do we stay here? We can dip in. We can come back. There's always an option. All right. Okay. Yes, guys. She's like, she's like, oh my God. She's like, she's like, okay, hang on. Pull. And this is going to be a quick one. You guys got to vote quick because we're going to move quick. Okay. Everybody vote, please. We're only going to leave it up for like a minute. This is a quick poll. We need, we need to know what we're doing. And at the same time, I'm loading it because I have a feeling I know what you guys are going to choose. <laughs> hang on.
Please vote now or forever hold your peace. Okay? Uh, damn it, where's our thing? Okay, ending the poll. Okay, we're gonna go in. We're gonna go in. We're gonna see what's going on. And if it sucks, we're gonna dip. Oh, Hang on. That's the, the, I think the whole paper clip thing was a bad idea because um, you guys are gonna think anytime I go, I'm gonna need that. So please don't oh my God. that. Thank you. No. No, oh, don't call the cops. Calm, calm down, down, everybody. everybody. Just let Just me reheat my, my meal, meal, okay? I'll call you. Okay, okay, okay. So she's telling everybody, don't panic. Forget about the, the safe word. I shouldn't have told you that. Please don't call the cops. Blah, 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 blah. Um, hang on. Never, never in a million years, never. I will never submit to premium, never. Never, never going to happen. Okay, so, so, so she left. She came back and she's heating up that food and apparently going to tell us. So this is the dip in. We're going to see if this is worth a down. We'll give her a chance to explain. If it's good, we stay. If it's bad, we bounce. Okay. What? I just want to guys let you know. I just want to let you know I'm okay. I don't think that mentally right now, obviously I'm in a good place to be on here. Um, I'm not in danger. What are you talking about? I'm not getting back with anybody <laughs> at all. Sure, Jan. I'm not. Julia. Sphinx Rain, thank you so much for the super chat, boo. Even YouTube Sofa King, I'm beginning to wonder, like, I don't know. I like coming on here, like, is to escape and to, like, feel safe and be with my beezers. But, like, I feel like I'm being, like, accused of, I don't know what's going on, like, Nothing that you guys are saying is happening. Well, that might be peace. No, I see all your comments. Just very worried. I know you guys are. It's just, it's freaking me out. <laughs> Captain Crunch, thank you so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Scorpio oh gang. God, November Scorpio gang. It's so fucked up. I can't deal right now, especially like... No, Shay. I don't have any clarity. I'm just like. <sighs> Hi, Denise. Oh, my God. Whoa, Julia, you don't get an arm shake. What is going on? I can't deal with reality right now. This is what's happening. All right, fine. Welcome, Julia. Ready, set, ease. I just feel really weird. I know. I've never are. seen her try to deny someone an arm shake. That was weird. <laughs> so we can Anyways, guys. All right. Here's the deal. to the shrooms. Yeah. And Bluehorn, thank you so much for the super chat. Oda, thank you, Oda. Thank you. 
I feel off, Stacy. I feel off. I'm okay, Punisher. Give me a minute. Sandy Shores, thank you again for the super chat, girl. Oh, what is this, a call, a message? What's going on? We got the little spinny thing. Oh, buffer in. Buffer in. <clears throat> Miss my smile. Hi, Tiffany. I don't know why you guys are worried. I feel like I've done something really wrong to everybody, like all around. No, I'm not making you feel bad at all. I'm not mad at you guys 100%, I swear. Why the fuck would she be mad at the chat? Jesus Christ. Talk. Hmm? Yeah. <clears throat> this is so stupid. I just need to get off live right now, guys. Um, this is just so messed up the whole thing no you're not stupid you guys are not no I love you guys um, so everyone nobody will talk about me what He's really mad I'm talking about him, so I don't want to talk about him anymore. Yes. So, I'm not in danger. No, I'm just gonna, let's just. The smirk. This is such a mess. I need to get off live stream, you guys. Or I want to stay on live stream. Just, I know. Oh, the smirk just pisses me right off. Smug bitch, man. But she spoke in important pieces, ready, set, bees. Oh my God, wasn't she about to tell us something? Damn it. Ulysse. Oh my God, I remember Ulysse. Welcome, Ulysse. Girl, oh. you know he has his own phone. <laughs> Come on. He one for the whores and one for the charmoots. Ah, you gotta keep everything separated. I just wanna hang out with Pete right now, actually.
Luis, I need your opinion. <laughs> Why are you paying? Oh my God, you guys, stop. I'm sorry, listen, okay. It's not that I like it. It's not that I'm, this is honestly, Mama Bear, I'm not taking anything as a joke and I'm not, I know that he's watching. I'm not taking this as a joke. It's all just really, really overwhelming for me right now, honestly. And I just want to like, I don't know how to react because I microdosed on shrimps today and I'm feeling really weird. So just please leave me alone for a minute. <laughs> Tripping balls and paranoid as all hell. I love this. This is actually hilarious to me. I just need a minute, okay? That bag is from Quebec. That's Fleur de Lis. Why would there be a Quebecois bag in her kitchen if he's not from Gat? No. Or maybe that's the bag they put 16 Nashies into. <laughs> Is this is this crying making a call from another phone to Koki or interesting? What could be going on? So many options. Wow. I just want a bees. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Oh y'all. All right. We'll, we'll wait and see what's going on when she comes back. <laughs> This is sad. Um, I mean, I guess it's possible. I guess it's possible. Oi, oi, oi. This is nuts. <laughs> I don't know what to say. <laughs> no, when she said she took the shrooms again, I lost it. Like, so you're paranoid. The guy's calling you. You feel all freaked out. You're high on mushrooms, which makes you fucking paranoid, you know? Oh, no. Who would take mushrooms at a time like this? You know what's going on. You've got all this shit going on. Why the hell would you take mushrooms right now? I don't get. Oh, okay. Wait, wait. Yeah. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, how are we going to see this chat? How am I going to position this? Okay, wait. Give me a second to figure this out. And we're going to watch her chat. I just don't know how we're going to see it. Wait. Why can this miss it me? Okay, wait. Is it showing? Oh, okay. We have chat. Wait a minute. I'll make it bigger. No, it doesn't. Can you see that? Does it like normal size for you guys? <laughs> I don't know. It looks weird. Oh my. Oh, 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 we're back. We're back. Wait. Oh no. How do I? Oh no. I've messed it all up good now. <laughs> I hate this. What did I do? <laughs> Shit. Mm. <laughs> Oh, okay. She's not back. She just moved the camera for a second. Okay, we wait. Top chat. No, we want all chat. We want all the juice. We don't want to miss any juice. Okay. Okay. Somebody queefed says she has the look of terror in her eyes. Paperclip says, what's going on? Plain cheeseburger. What did I say? Is the stream in? Oh, what happened? It went white. What happened? The screen is white. What's going on? Oh. Hmm. It's still going. There's still messages going. She's off live? Okay. Okay. All right. Let's end this then. Wait a minute. Oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, thank God. Interesting. She left. 
okay. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, she's tripping. She's paranoid. She's got... Wait. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she's ending the stream again, apparently. That's what the chat's saying. Okay. Okay. Well, that was a lot. Hmm. She's back on live. I'll feel... She'll be back soon. Is she back? Anyway, I'm sure you guys will let me know when she comes back and we'll decide what to do. Do we want to go in? Because she was about to tell us something and it seems like he called and it shut her up. So I want to know what the hell was she about to just tell us? Something's going on. Ooh. Ooh. Sabina Mam says, I think she's calling the cops. Could be. Oof, 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 oof interesting turn of events. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's going on. That's wild. Wild, y'all. Okay. Oh, my God. It's not funny, but it's funny. Okay. Listen, li listen. We don't know that Koki has a key for sure. We don't know that. But on our phone call, I asked her if it was possible. I said, did Koki ever have your keys? Like a chance alone with your keys for a couple hours. She went, oh yeah. I went, change your locks at the end of the month when you get paid from YouTube. I'm sure she didn't do it, but. <laughs> okay. Okay. She's, she's still buffering, but she hasn't ended the live yet. Oh, okay. I don't know. What, what do we do? Do we go back to what we were? Do we wait for Shanta? Do you think she's going to come back? The chat is still live, though. Caps lock. Okay, hang on. Caps lock. Let me get back in there. <laughs> hang on. I closed it because I thought she can't. I, she, she, she ended it. This is a lot. Hold up. Hold up. I don't see it. Oh, I do see it. Uh, don't give me hell about the ads. I'm never paying for premium. It's never going to happen. Okay. Okay, yeah, it's still buffing. It's buffing. Let's put the chat on. Let's see what the people are saying. We want all the tea. I'm okay. Okay. <laughs> if you say so, Sean, too. Okay. You see? You see? Okay, it's good. It's good. It's up there. Okay, we want all chat. We want all tea. Ooh, Skinny Legend says, Chantal is not in danger. She just wants to salvage their pathetic relationship. Yikes. All right. Well. Oh, my God. This is intense. Intense. This is bad because she's made everybody so nervous with the safe word and the bullshit and all that. She knows everyone's so nervous. She can't just leave the stream like buffering like this. She know she knows what she's doing right now. I don't believe it. It's not sincere. My opinion. <laughs> um, there. Jilly Bean, thank you so so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it, girl. Thank you for being here. Well, okay. We're waiting. We're waiting. We're waiting to see what's happening. You think she's trolling Wiccan Mother 77? Could be a troll. I think this is a money play. This is sympathy. Ask Pats. She knows that people have been pissed with her lately. They don't like what's going on, you know? She does. You're right. Hang on. Shenanigans. She does love making people worry. I agree. She likes it. She likes the, I don't know, the attention. Again, it's just another way she likes attention. Oy, oy, oy. What is going on? Oh, yeah, 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 that like to dislike ratio is pretty harsh. Let me add one to the pot. <laughs> okay, okay, let's see what the chat is saying. Oh. Oh. Yeah, everyone's bitching. The boy who cried wolf, I'm sick of her leaving the chat. Honest hour. Oy, oy, oy. 
I don't know what to say, guys. What what should, what should we do? Do we wait here for Chantel? I don't know what to do. Heather Marie, thank you so, so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Yeah, girl, we all love a good train wreck. <laughs> We've been sitting here for like three hours watching a train wreck. I love it. Friday, girl gang, hey. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> I'm just saying. Oh my god, girl. That is fucking hilarious. Oh. Oh yeah, you. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I hope she comes back, Trisha, because frankly, people are nervous. She I don't, I don't think it's right, okay? I just don't. You you can't have a uh, talking about your safe word and bullshit like that, and then just leave the chat spinning like this. People, you know what's gonna happen. People are gonna start calling the popo. It's gonna be a fucking mess. She can't do this. This is very, very inappropriate. I don't know. She's fucking negligent. Seattle Sapphire's low carb rule. Thank you again for the super chat, girl. I really appreciate it. Yeah, I'd say that is absolute truth right there. Holy crap. Oh my god. Oy. <laughs> Savage Keyboard says, she's not terrified. She's in love. God, I could puke. What's love got to do with it? Literally, in this case. Please. Oh, come on. I know. What is my life? I was just thinking the same thing. And then you said it, girl. Sitting here, waiting for this biatch to come back. Waiting on a black screen spinning. Um, okay. I think here's what we're going to do. We're going to go back to where we were. I'm going to keep this tab open. When she comes back, if she comes back, because I'm not sure, to be honest, we dip right back in. Okay? We have no time to waste on this. Okay, wait. And we're also skipping ahead on the stream we were watching because I'm losing my patience. I'm sitting here fed up and I don't I don't I don't have the attention span for all of this. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. My browser can't access my screen. Try capturing a different screen to see if this continues. Why? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Something happened. Something happened. Let me try this again. You better work. Don't play with me. <laughs> Stupid computer. I don't know how to fix this. <gasps> yes. Okay. I like when things just fix themselves. That's true. No, it's just like it's just a compare, like no one's I guess curly. You know what I mean? I don't know. So this may girl come back, talk to someone here. What? C I B, she said. What are you talking about? So the main girl comes back. What the fuck? What? I'm trying to be clear, like form. I need to like collect myself. Dom and I are done for good in every way. Okay. Oh 
Oh my god. Oh my. I'm not laughing. I gotta go. No. I can't. Guys, listen. Whoops. You have to realize that I took too many mushrooms. So this is all like not real for me. This is like just crazy. Like, sorry guys. Bella juice. Bella Juice, really need you to read my comment on live stream night. My friend lost her best friend to a psychotic break because of shrooms. Really? <clears throat> Thank you for the super chat. You know what? No, like maybe I, I don't think I'm going to do them anymore because I'm not having a good time right now at all. And I know that these are really, really serious no, Sandra, that's Oh the my thing. god, These if really Chantal serious, starts bad touch. tripping on mushrooms, I'm sorry, I will never stop laughing and people are going to call me an asshole. I'll have to cut the camera off. People. <laughs> okay. I'm in a weird space mind of mine right now. Everybody just Oh my god. No, I'm never ever taking them ever again. I swear to you guys, like this is it. Like this is I don't like this feeling. I feel really weird. I don't feel myself. I can't deal with reality right now. So I thought the whole microdosing thing, I would do it because it would be good for like depression and things like that. Um, but the thing is, is like, I'm not doing it with a doctor. <laughs> so I'm just doing it on my own. Um, so that's probably number one. Also, I, I don't know. Um, I have a lot of psychiatric conditions that I'm being treated with, with traditional medicine and, um, probably didn't think of how that's going to react, you know? Um, so I'm sorry, you guys, I'm, I just want you to know, like for real, I'm not thinking any of this is a joke. You should do them when you are in a peaceful environment with something you trust and activated. Yeah, that's strong i don't mean to infuriate you guys or worry you guys at all um yeah i'm not doing mushrooms for a moment more um yeah i don't have any more edibles i'm seriously not doing any more edibles for a while like edibles is better than the mushrooms what the fuck no. um I just want to finish my meal. <laughs> it's been like five hours. And I just want to like be peaceful and cool, like normal for like just an hour. Okay, just leave me alone. <laughs> Flush them down. Home. Sophie King, I love you. Oh my gosh. Ange. Shay, I love Shay. I love Ange. Ange and Sandy. You guys are leaving. Why? Don't leave me, guys. I need you guys right now. For real. Don't leave me, guys. Listen. So the whole reason behind the mushrooms was to try to help with the depression. That I love you too, Sarah Jane, KB, everybody. I love you guys. Kristen, oh my God, I didn't see you. April, May, I love all you guys. I really do. I honestly, and I don't like that you guys, like it hurts my feelings that you guys think that of me. Oh, uh, people are hurting her feelings. I don't know. 
Oh. I'm not manipulating. That's the last thing I want to do. I don't know why you guys feel that way. I don't know how to chill, how to. I don't know how to make you feel different. We're here to stay. I don't feel you're in any danger. I think you just run with your emotions too much and say things at the moment. Yes, and then change with the next emotion. That's exactly how I am, Maureen. April, May. You're here, April, May. Sticks and stones. Chris. Oh. Savage keyboard. This is so toxic. I know. Wow, you know it's bad when Savage Keyboard thinks there's a problem with it. Jesus. I'm going to upload your other emoji. TTMR. Smoke a bong. Yeah, edibles are different. No, the mushrooms, I don't like them, guys. I feel really weird. Crazy for coffee. Yeah, I don't, I think it's like, I don't want to talk. Just like, I don't want to talk about him anymore. I don't want to, I'm done. I don't want to talk about him anymore. I don't want to answer questions about him. I don't want to, because it makes it worse. It makes it worse. Like, I don't, We've you know heard I mean? this before. So. Yes, I know paper clip. You guys just, I know. I'm going to deal. Just let me deal with it, please. Just give me some time. Like, I'm not in my right head to deal with anything. I just want to be like, let's just hang out. <laughs> Did you cancel? Somebody just messaged me. Did you cancel HelloFresh? Let's just bees and like, you know. Anyway. You know what, my punching bag, so I would see one. Yeah, that's not my intention. Boring. Although, I guess I don't think about how what I do affects you guys. Stop it. I'm going to have to block you, Paperclip. Oh, I know what oh, you're I doing. What you're doing. I'm blocking. Somebody made the name Paperclip in her chat. <laughs> okay, no, I won't you know, block. I won't. But unhide user. But change your name or else I will block you. <laughs> I don't want you to be like, you said it three times, so now you're going to come talk. Please don't, Please don't, 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 do, don't do that. Okay, I want to be Paperclip now. <laughs> I'm so tired. No, you guys, I'm not going anywhere. I'm staying in my house. <coughs> no, it's not, Sarah Jane. Lori Cop, thank you again for the super chat, girl. Thanks again for being here. Thank God it's Friday. <laughs> I totally agree, Peggy Hill. Oh my God. Oh, I'm putting up oh, the bowl. Oh, well, the cop could be your next chapter. Thank you so much for the super chat, Diamond Girl. I really appreciate it. Accountable Beauty uh, talks mad shit about me, always has, always tries to stir the pot with dumb shit. Move to Toronto? Oh, and you guys, you, you guys live in Toronto? Cool. No, I don't want you guys to get me out of it. I don't, want, I, I just, I guess I just expect you guys to just listen and not feel sometimes. 
and that's not right. So I apologize. Yeah. I'm a mess, I know. And mushrooms don't help. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't know how to do I don't deal with things very well at all, like at all. I'm love bombing you guys. Cause I do love you guys. I just want a few chips. <clears throat> Sorry, it's because they were like staring at me the whole time. Over there, the dill pickle are my favorite. <laughs> so anyway. Yeah, Page Master. Hi, Page Master. Sphinx Rain. Thank you so much. Sphinx, Sphinx Rain just sent me um, a DM. Uh, what Accountable Beauty said about me in the chat. So Accountable Beauty says that thoughts on French Fried Girl dropping out of school to start YouTubing full time as of October 1st. <laughs> Are you fucking kidding me? By October 1st, I'm starting the stash. That means I'm like this close to done. Man, if you don't stop then, you certainly don't stop at the stash. Only an idiot would go that far and stop. And I'm certainly not that idiot. Why is there a person in here named Dom Stolen Laundry? Okay, I gotta go. Okay, vote, go. guys. I'm gonna end I the poll. Go for now, Please. Right? I'm just like chill out by myself. My grandma, I thought she was 80, she was 79. People find taking shrooms therapeutic. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna yeah, stay for a little Halloween. bit. Oh, it was close, but we're staying for a bit, okay? And we'll vote again. Yeah, the Halloween Horror Nights, like watching the mazes. Morgan, how does it feel to have been a failure from the second you were born until this very minute? You have ruined your body, your mind, and the lives of everyone around you. Feels pretty shitty. Um... I just wanted to make you laugh. You guys are succeeding at it. <laughs> Haven't told us what you said you would this live in this live. Thank you so much for the super chat, uh, Lucky Charms. I really appreciate it. You guys want a Mario beef? No, we don't. <laughs> Chinese piece of garlic bread. <laughs> Still don't think we've heard a word about the grandmother, have we? Mm. Anyways. Just saying once another pull too sweet. Okay, coming right up. Okay, Sandra. Have a good day. I was just reading the message. My mom was just messaging. Not Jacob Emmons. Thank you so much for the super chat. Uh, 
don't know what you guys think. Thanks, Shay. Ketchup, chips, nashies. You guys don't have souvlaki? My mom's the same, like, yeah. I'm going to message her right now, Accountable Beauty, and see when I'm going to see her. Today's Friday. Anyway, I kind of want to go. Oh, so. You did, Angie? Hey, have a soup, oh. Mom. It's okay, Angie. You guys are sweet. Okay, vote. Guys, we're gonna end the poll. Vote now, please. Maybe I'm gonna Mario Bees or something. Wait, it's Friday. That's why Lewis is messaging me because he's drunk. Shroomy Beauty, welcome to Very Important Beezers. Ready, set, bees. I was just going to say, oh, Walmart pickle chips. I ate a whole bag of chips yesterday, and I still lost weight today. Three pounds. No, wait. I was three, 341. Yes, we have the plain ones, but we don't have the spicy oh, ones. I'm going to message my mom real quick. Oh, she's messaging her mom. Oh, my God. Hang on. Hang on. We're out. I'm ending the poll. Vote now, please. Okay, there it is. There's your results. We, we're we out. Okay, out. And happy to be out. I'm happy to be out. Y'all, I'm going to be straight with you guys. We have been streaming for almost exactly four hours. I'm exhausted. I've been up since four o'clock in the morning. And it's been a hell of a day. We'll talk about today another day because today was a real day for me. But today, it's not about me. It's about Chantal. But very much to do with this. We'll talk about it on the weekend. Okay. I'm, I'm emotionally spent today. I don't even want to get into it, but we got some stuff to talk about pertaining to today. Okay. Oh. Um, we'll get into it on the weekend. How's that on our next sesh? We have some stuff to talk about. All right. But for tonight, guys, I'm going to have to end it. This has been one hell of a stream. Thank you guys so, 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 so much for being here. I'm sorry to end it so abruptly, but y'all, it's been four hours. I'm fucking exhausted. And I'm sure a lot of you are feeling the same. She is draining. She's a lot. We've watched a lot. Today was a lot. So, uh, Lychee Nut, thank you so much for the super sticker, girl. I really appreciate it. And thank you guys so, so much for being here, for passing your your whole friggin' Friday afternoon or evening or whatever, wherever you are with me. I really appreciate it. This was a, a kind of an out there girl gang sesh. We didn't have the normal laughs that we normally like to have on a Friday, but we just had too much to get to. And then her being live and blah, blah, blah. 
there's still a couple things left in this stream that we haven't seen, okay? The stream that we were watching today. I'm going to just take clips, little clip, clip, clip. We'll get into that in our next Girl Gang session because I got no more patience for this stream. We've put four hours into this and I'm done. <laughs> Y'all, everybody have a really, really, really good Friday. Enjoy. <laughs> it's the weekend. It's Friday night. Breathe and enjoy it. Thank you guys again so much for being here. Thank you again to the mods for being here. I really appreciate you guys. Y'all, everybody have a great night. Take care. Be safe. Please keep your masks on. And we will meet back here maybe tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow. We'll see about a tentative tomorrow. Okay, guys? Oh, hang on. Openly avoidant. Oh, my God. I don't want to miss it. I almost missed it. Wait. Openly. Ah! Openly avoidant. Thank you so, so much for the super chat. I really appreciate it. Gruel, have a great weekend. Everybody have a great night because we will be seeing each other, I hope, tomorrow. We're going to do something tomorrow, okay? Even if it's a quickie. We'll be here tomorrow. It definitely won't be four hours. Have a great night, everybody. Bye.